a sensation for the game show with that water. The most fantastic sensation. something at least. So yeah. I'm just gonna check something here real quick. I also want to make sure that my Twitch is actually that... Uh, I totally want to make sure that Twitch is working fine, so I'm gonna check this. I'm gonna check my own screen just to make sure everything is working fine. Hmm. I, I, I better say that, sorry, but yeah. Hope you guys are doing good right now and. Yeah, so let's just check my screen quality and after that we can be able to start the stream. Just. Let's see. Okay, here says that it's online and it's working beautifully, so yeah, let's begin. Also, for people who have me in the Discord group, uh, like I explained earlier, I will be in the group stream voice chat in case you guys want to join. So yeah, hooray for that. So... Uh, let's... Actually, let me see if I can uh, go with this and uh, the other side, so I can see. Okay, here yeah, I can see now, so I'm gonna put this here. Perfect, now I can see the chat. And now I can see the chat. Okay, Stop this now, and let's jump right into the game. Uh, oh. So there we go. So now time to jump into the game. Checking the capture device. Yeah, it's working fine. The only problem is the mouse. I don't want it to show the mouse. Uh -huh. So let's take a look. Uh, show mouse. There we go. Yeah, I don't want this thing to show the mouse. I also want your help, guys, so you guys can let me know how is everything working. The sound and everything. So, start game. Uh, no, I'm not gonna continue. 
17 to our So yeah, let's begin with this game of the writing. I hope the volume is fine. If not, I'm gonna see what I have to do. Hey buddy, you mentioned something about research for a story. That's right. Got a tip that something big's happening. In a nowhere little town like that? They sure didn't mention anything about it on TV. Yeah, well, I'm freelance, pal. I don't make my living waiting for the TV to tell me what to cover. <laughs> Here she is. <laughs> Willamette, Colorado. Population 53,594. Distinguishing characteristics, jack shit. <laughs> About the only thing to do in this town is kill time at the shopping mall. What was that? The army? Yeah. <laughs> Looks like taking a helicopter was the way to go. I bet they got all the roads blocked off by now. All right, listen. I want to get shots of the whole town before the National Guard finishes roping it off. Take me over the main street. Okay, so here we are now. We are at the first part of the game where we're going to be taking photos. And the microphone is a little far away, so let me move it closer. And okay, again, please, guys. And if the volume of my voice is a little too quiet, just let me know. Whoa! What is that? Some kind of riot? I will see what I can do. Or at least just to make sure that everything is working fine. Not really a problem for taking pictures, but okay, and I will have to do that because why not? Is this what you came to take pictures of? Yeah, I'm a sadistic. I came to take pictures of people dying. <laughs> I work for the morgue, you know. No way! Check that out! Look at all those people! What the hell is happening here? Also, I have to admit the city is beautifully... I have no idea. The one model? For sure. I mean, for an old game, it's such a really good... Well, I'm actually playing the PC version. But still, for a... For a slightly improved game, looks actually really good. Uh, what else we can take photos? No, I can't hear you. Actually, he says that you are uh, silenced. Uh, oh, I skipped the scene. I thought you can be able to pause this. Uh, let me actually. You are unmuted. Uh, let me check there instead. Let me see what is going on. But yeah, thanks for letting me know. For some reason I can't hear you, let me check. Uh, no, I can't hear you. Uh, user volume is fine. It's a- oh, that was me, I logged from my Twitch just to see how everything was. And uh, let me check the channel actually. Uh, because yeah, I can't actually hear you unless you are talking and people can hear you there. Uh, let me check. Uh, yeah, everything is fine. 
and a channel, a channel, click, pick, try and Okay, say something. Actually, I think what I think you know what I think that is the streamer mode. You can set key by automatically disable. Uh, okay, let me check. Maybe the streamer mode. Let me join the channel again. Just wait me a second. Okay, I can't hear absolutely anything of the volume, uh, voice activity. Oh shit, what have I done? <laughs> or oh, you know what? Uh, actually, let me check. Uh, let's move to another channel. Let's move to the group calls and see if that works. What the hell is going on? Actually, yeah, let me check what is going on right now. Because for some reason I can't hear voices. Uh, um, let me check. Uh, Discord. I already have Discord open. I, oh, I think you know what is the output probably of the sound. Uh, let me check still. Voice and video. Output. Uh, okay. Hey! There, now I can hear you guys. Hello? Hello there. No, hey. now you can hear us. Yeah, apparently it was a weird configuration on the sound. Hey, what's up? Sup, dudes. I'm sorry. I was doing like a nappy impression. I'll be your nappy for... for if you're if you're allowed me oh my god please don't do that <laughs> oh come on this, this game is like zelda it's a, uh, yeah, it's you a know? group call and fighter i don't know if you have I... discord but if you have you can come here and and join to the to the group right now with me there is uh my friend kai and azur so yeah if you have discord you can join the call the link for the group is actually on my on my FA, and if, or if you are right there in the group, you can already join the call. Oh well, uh, well let's I get this voice. train wreck of a zombie game on a road. Exactly. I remember this, Rex. So you might get annoyed getting a call from this guy, but I'm gonna be like this guy as well, calling you. I probably the the thing that's probably going to annoy me the most will be the survivors. I mean, every time I'm gonna be running and hey, I'm trying to sell you, Frank! I will be like, fuck. <laughs> well, it looked pretty worse than taking care of Ashley from Resident Evil 4. Also, I'll be sharing some links around a few things, my my own Discord server and and Leonardo and Twitter. Okay. I'm gonna support your your stream now. <laughs> okay, so. Something you guys are going to see is that probably I grabbed the Mega Buster. No. I, I thought you said you weren't going to use it. Yeah, I don't gonna use it. I just yeah, that'll be cheating. Just like very, very, very last resource. Like. So well, I, I guess you could use it at this part because this part doesn't matter. Yeah. For example, where I, where I don't going to use the Mega Buster is actually at Psychopaths because that would be bullshit. Only if I see I'm running out of time for a scoop or for a mission, then I will probably going to use it just to kill the psychopath and keep moving because I forgot to say, but I'm gonna try to rescue all the different survivors. I already have a list here of all the 50 survivors. Okay, so you know about the guy who's just like in that closet covered by boxes. Yeah. Yeah, I hated him. He was the one I always missed. Oh god, this woman. Hey, this is no time to ogle pretty girls, son. 
You looking to get yourself eaten alive by zombies? What? Did you just say zombies? Take a look out there. If those ain't zombies, what would you call them? Now here comes the part where you just question why. <laughs> oh, they are gamers. They have insomnia. It's normal. They are not zombies. There's been more and more of them since last night. No, they're just waiting to get in. Yeah. They yeah. just want the new game yeah. system. It's Black Friday all over again. Zombies. Also doing fine Stupid for us, The way you mentioned, you just remind me of the traitor of Dead safe. Rising 4. It was like, like, right, really, then. like, like poor emanation. It was like, unforgivable, like, Bring anything we can use all for the, the low here. price sales. And, and when you see Ongoing. people grabbing teddy bear and torn it up, and you see it switch to a zombie attack, and, and, you know, it's pretty a great emanation. It's like art. It was. So yeah, we got now. Actually, it's a funny thing. I'm gonna see if I can try to solve it, but I'm getting this weird Perfect. error with Dead Rising Three, where every time I launch it, it crashes. I don't know. Can you just kill one of the women already? Prevent the whole thing from happening. Oh yes. Uh, Lindsay, you must die. Well, if I can, I will do that. Yeah, too, but you can't do it on this part. Just look you at that face. It felt like you can be up the old lady who <laughs> wants her body back. Kill Lindsay, because look. she's the one that causes all this shit to happen. And look what happened. All these zombies yeah. quickly, and all these people are like, Oh my god! Look at the animation! The hand just trespassed his fucking face. What was clipping? What is clipping? Wow. Yeah. He, he screwed us all. That's how human world yeah. people, they always stick their We just shove our that. fingers into our faces, <laughs> deep into <laughs> our skulls. Or is that her name? <laughs> Michael Pollard is dead. Owen's oh. dead. Kelly's dead. Oh my god. Right Everyone's you dead! You did this to us, yeah, Lindsay! You and your stupid fucking it. dog! No! Chris from Resident Evil is dead! This guy looks like old Scrooge from the, the Christmas tale. It's Barnaby! <laughs> old man Barnaby! How oh, an old lady can pull people, push away people like that? I don't know. Same. All this just for a goddamn dog. Yeah. Yep. It wasn't worth it. You got yourself killed, woman, and you got a whole bunch of other people killed too. Quick, move. Uh, this maintenance guy, really. Move this way. Quick, to the stairs. Move. Hi, Brad. Oh no, Oops, I'm sorry. Oops, I'm sorry. I can't find it. Are you killing the survivors? That I die no matter what. <laughs> that die no matter what. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you can. <laughs> <laughs> you just held them to their death faster. Yeah, that was funny. I was trying to hit a zombie, and I hit a true survivor right in front of me. Ryan Reynolds is dead. No. So oh, many dead people. The clown is dead. How could you kill a famous movie actor, Brian Reynolds? Oh no. Where the Who other? will play Deadpool now? Oh no, I ruined Deadpool I for everyone. I hope they got away. Rexo, what did you do? I ruined lives of everyone. <laughs> you ruined the best franchise ever. No. Cough, 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 cough. Now this old man will be a big problem. Uh -huh.
as long as those things are in the I'm gonna be a big problem in a voice call. Oh. I'm gonna be yeah, like this story. old man. He's doing <laughs> that without the protection mask? That uh, old guy is blind forever doing? now. Yeah. D don't worry about Otis. They'll get us back into the mall. And apparently, those things aren't smart enough to use. Don't them. worry about Otis. Things happen oh, later in, in the series. Wait a minute. Yeah. You want to get back in there? <laughs> he get new eyes. What for? Oh, yeah, his name is Otis. Oh, yeah, funny thing I actually remember now. In the Daniel Gaming, you can actually find Otis' hey, photo hey. portrayed image in Dead Rising 3. I don't know why he's there. But I had questioned nice why he's look. gone. If you, you hit. Photographer? Actually, I don't want to. I don't want to say that. I feel like I spoil it. Don't well, say anything well. else. Could you show me Sorry. some pictures, Frank? I know exactly why he's there in Dead Rising Three. Yeah, all the games have that kind of little spoilers that try to connect the stories from each other. It's a nice detail, actually. You really yeah. seem to know what you're doing. It's called world building, what and I like guys, it. Anyway. You. And what are you? I took that one Jessica. near the entrance. Fine booty. That guy do we'll talk about Otis and uh, Dead Rising 3 when that gets played. Exactly. Nope. But Thanks. for now, Otis is here in Dead Rising 1, protecting people, I'm sort of. Uh, uh, hey, we're not done talking yet. Just who are Annoying you? a photographer named Frank West, yes. I'm Jesse. The man you saw earlier is Brad. Hello? That's all Hello, I'm authorized to tell one. you. Hello? Hello, we can Hello. hear you. Hi. Hello, Doug. Welcome to the call of the stream of Dead Rising 1. We have 71 hours before the helicopter comes. I can shoot Oh, cool. You. More people who I don't know. I'm actually the one from chat right now. Oh, hey. hey. Yeah, Sorry. he's the one from chat. Yes, I actually talk right now. Okay, you're gonna spin while he talks. That's the best way to spend the time. Oh yeah! Just yeah. shoot Otis! <laughs> I will for sure! But yeah! Alright, so, if, if you run by these people who are on the rooftop, you just skip them and, and then later come back and, and take them to the safe house. It's a little easy to do it. I probably won't do that. Also, I forgot to say, I'm gonna probably will be saving a lot. Because Survivor hey, seems to be really stupid here, and I'm gonna take a yes. picture of this. You also by saving them, like, take them to the safe house. In Dead Rising 3, you don't Fantastic. have to take them to the safe house. Don't worry, I'll be safe! And they ran away. Okay, so let me... No, Jeff, don't talk to me. Uh... Oh yeah, wrong one. No! Leave me alone! You're scary! Ah, I feel safe. But yeah, for all of you guys in the chat, feel free to talk and everything. I don't bite. We are here to have fun and be random, like craziness. Hello! Yeah, he actually doesn't like bite, he just stomps. Yeah. Let me get your roadman on the malls. So... Okay, oh, shit! Like that man didn't follow you, because if he did, then you have to take care- You have to take to the, to the safe room. I mean, I usually when I do this, I just take both of them to the safe room and then do this. Yeah, it was like a like a, a starter part, basically to get you into the game. Yeah, I deactivate the tutorial so we don't have those annoying parts. Yeah, both Dead Rising One and Two gets really annoying if you want to save many people as you can. You right, especially you want that achievement where you save everyone or at least everyone. I'm gonna try it. I located him on the monitor. Have you gotten that achievement before? Mm, only one Brad. will take me a lot of time. Also, Shadow Dragon, right, welcome to the stream fine. of Dead Rising 1. Gun. Oh. Come on. Dead Rising 1 is the only Dead Rising no. game I did no. get all the I achievements for. That's against regulation. This is actually the one game yeah, that I actually well, I don't spent think they how many years of in mine when they wrote I don't know how many years I spent kid. on this, but it took me... I think you know probably how to use three this? to four plus years to try Kinda. to get that that like seven I've hour achievement you know. or something like that. You know the real life in game hour. Oh, oh life my life. god! I literally wasted my time to get that sword. Like, you didn't do the cheap method. Gather all the food items and Look, stay in one high spot you. where they can't you get you. I'm gonna have a nice little chat. Anywho, sorry about that. <laughs> Anyways, Anyways, yeah. Before... 
before you make any progress, you you roll around. Maybe for the bet you have to wait till one character appeared. I think that his name um Ken? No, Kent. No. Um Kent the photographer? Yeah, that guy. Or Kenny, I think it was. I think it was actually Kent. I, yeah, I think it's uh, Kent. Uh, yeah, you have to wait <laughs> by simply clicking off and then when Otis call you by saying, Hey, there's a cameraman around and he'll spawn. Yeah, I'm gonna go get to Go get the katana! That's what I'm gonna do. Yes, the only reason why I have a lot of problems in this uh, game is mostly because the survivors are a bunch of idiots. They're a bunch of dumbasses. Yeah, they have no reason to leave. They always get stuck and just jail at you for freeing and... Oh good, Rexo's doing what I did my first run. Yeah, just make, cool. take all the orange juices, make all the nectars. <laughs> okay, we're actually full level. I forgot about that. Oh god, if there's, so one, get the this, katana. if there's one thing that this game was also frustrating for, it's the jumping. When you're actually trying to land on, like, extra, like, you know when you're trying to get that uh, submachine gun in that area? <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, that's the horrible. Jumping, the jumping could just be like, jump, Oh nope, throws you off for no reason even though you look like you would have landed and you just plummet into a horde of zombies. <laughs> yeah, it's terrible! <laughs> yeah, it's annoying. Also, the, the zombies can grab you easily. It's like, you pass close to them and you literally get grabbed. Yeah, but then Frank has to take like a full five seconds to do that whole I land on the floor and get up. Uh, yeah, that's the annoying part. Oh wait, are you gonna go for the uh... Are you gonna go for the chainsaw with the two books or the three books? I mean, the three yeah. books, yes. Yeah, the three to books. get like that two thousand durability or something. <laughs> Where yeah. you can just about kill three thousand zombies with just one of them. Yeah, and then you could just and then you could just go back for another. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I'm really good to do that a lot. Or you know, better yet, get <laughs> one, get the first chainsaw, get the cutscene, grab the second chainsaw. Actually, yeah, that's also a better idea. <laughs> you got like. 6,000 kills on there now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Actually, for people who doesn't know, if you want to get the achievement for the 50k zombies, you have to go to the tunnels and stay there. Yes, the and then just drive back and forth, oh. running everything over. I did that. That was... You know something that I realized oh, about that no. achievement? I'm doing the adding thing again. No! What to do that? Oh my god, I'm adding again here. Oh my god. You know what took me a long time to notice about that damn achievement? That it was super easy to get doing that, that other achievement for it? No, the reference to it. The zombie genocide. Oh yeah, 53,594 or 64. It's one of those numbers. It was, it's the entire town of Willamette, that's why. Yeah, I know, I actually, I actually <laughs> caught on to it. I'm just like, hey, wait a minute, didn't I hear this from somewhere? Looks over. <laughs> looks over at the beginning cutscene. Oh, hey! <laughs> It took me until earlier this year to recognize that. Who? Jesse? That's how slow I am with this. You were not the only one. I also thought that and it was like, what the fuck is wrong? So if I kill everyone in Willamette, why there is still a ton of fucking zombies? Because the... I don't know. Alright, I'll cover you from here. You need to stick to the If you did kill everything, I don't know! And what am I supposed to do when I get caught? <laughs> it's such a stupid game, I love it! I'm actually, you know what I'm actually wondering? Guy. Who's got the highest kill count but of like as many that. zombies in those three days as possible? Actually, now I'm curious. I'm gonna try to look trouble. for that after just Are you up to it? I, either that <laughs> or the infinite mode. Camera. Like, I wanna see how many people have killed how but many yeah, zombies. Just like, what? Is there right. somebody there out there who's got like a million or they hit Next the max mark and there's just nothing but 99999 zombie kills? I'll lay down a suppressing fire. Oh my god, can you imagine that? He literally killed yes. the population of the entire planet. Just one zombie under a trillion. One. <laughs> two. Three. Oh yeah, this is the one game that for the first time I got confused on why the pistols carry 30 bullets. I'm just like, what in fuck? <laughs> I'm being serious, the pistol has so much ammo. I don't know why it has that much ammo, and it's usually a good weapon in this one, compared to two. Oh, Jeff Mayuri said. Yeah, that was a good idea, Kai. I lost a survivor already. Wait, how? <laughs> yeah, he's dead now. What? <laughs> this is why you just do it! At the beginning! 
<laughs> just Wait, how? He, he died! Okay, the, what happens in game, whenever a survivor is off screen for a long time, they lose health over time. You not really talking with him, but leave him there, just completely let him die out without even really doing anything. So okay. he just basically died on the rooftop. <laughs> this is why I just oh, take them. <laughs> Wait, okay, just take them into the goddamn room. Yeah, I'm gonna do that now. <laughs> <laughs> Save their fucking asses before they just die. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> In a completely like... safe environment, too. That's the bad part. Yeah, it happened the first time. It happened the first time. The first time I was thinking. All right. The first time I was thinking is maybe I can come back after rescuing another survivor. Next thing you know, they just die. I'm just like, what happened? <laughs> what they die from? <laughs> <laughs> they should have killed them, but they just assume, oh, we gotta die. <laughs> oh, I'll just cut oh, my wrist until oh, Frank comes oh, back. Shit, sorry. <laughs> what a good beginning for this adventuring villa, man. <laughs> I told you it was gonna be a train wreck. <laughs> I feel so sorry. <laughs> oh, actually, hey, have you, have you guys ever thought of uh, grabbing the shotgun from that one dude in the horde? Or do you think that's just a big old waste of health? Oh my god, I, didn't I know don't that. remember. Oh wait, there's a, oh yeah, there's a shotgun that's in the middle of the fountain. Yeah, somewhere around there you can get your like first actual gun in the game, you just gotta risk a lot of health for it. Either that it's or you just go in. I still love the fact that this game is the only game I know out there that allows hey, you to make Frank West spin like that. Oh wow. Play. Yeah. It's amazing and you gotta love it. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not get Jeff and his wife killed again. No matter yeah. if, if any survivor t t talks to you while you're in the middle of and you ran up, you can actually get them killed off stream. Oh my god. Let's this is such a good game. Jeff has joined you. By no, good, no, I no, mean no, this no, game no. is terrible Jeff at times. His wife is actually she kind of said that I still love this game. Love more the game but they had to put them in the rooftop <sighs> as early as part of the game. <laughs> oh my god. I forgot that this game's got a freaking airheaded AI. Oh my god, don't talk oh. about the AI, it's so goddamn oh. terrible. <laughs> oh no, he's eating her! <laughs> and then he's gonna I'm eat me! Oh my god! god. <laughs> 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 I'm how you make Frank West spin around like an idiot, right, so. I love it, this is the best way to it's spend time with It's beautiful! It's beautiful! I don't know what's wrong with it! <laughs> After all, pe normal people do this a lot when they are waiting. <laughs> yeah, they don't move their legs at all. They just spin in circles this okay. way. Okay, see, they need they need to get on the platform in order to get them to in get inside the safe room. Sim similarly, I think. So if they're not on the platform, then they're they're not coming in. I think. Yeah, they have to be on the raised ledge. Exactly. Yeah. I'm actually wondering, what was your guys' costume before in this? If you ever set out like a costume for Frank? Uh, I had one and... Was it? Either, 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 it was the either, Mega Man. I always used to run with... Oh, costume or, or a lady's outfit, because I'm not choosing a Mega Man costume, because Mega Man costume is just, like, over-popular to choose. I it's usually kind of go for the... That goblin mask and there is I think one or two other pieces I like to get. <laughs> I used to be Mega Man with one of the, Aww, the, Frank the, the things. I forget what the hell they're called. The boy I actually ran with the surfbot mask. That's with the surfbot mask. I was Mega Man costume surfbot mask. I want a surfbot mask like that in real life. That something like that just wearing over any costume would just be hysterical. <laughs> it's amazing. It's so just, funny. Just imagine just wearing that mask with that same happy expression, probably a little bit of blood on it from zombies and on just any costume. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it just works. <laughs> It's so good! Oh, 
I see Rex is a, uh, Rex was actually doing the uh oh god that <laughs> Yes, go get the re yeah. sorry about the ask. <laughs> yeah, I was I was trying to look where it actually is. Oh uh, back there, I think it was back there in the corner. Oh back there in the corner, okay I'm gonna look for it. Like you know where you just passed the um like toys right now when you just like went in that circle? Oh and zombie Jay. Okay there we go. The toys? He was getting a zombie Jay. <laughs> Okay, there's some, some good books around here, okay, so they might be handy. <laughs> the survive mascot. Another thing, if you fail the tent to see, like, certain <laughs> characters, you'll see them being zombified. Because it might happen. Seriously. Oh yeah, there is. Hmm. It was like, like, like right, a... Right, I'm gonna see. Oh, 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 right. Wait for it. Oh boy. Uh oh. Ooh. Are you trying to get <laughs> yeah, to spawn? Yes! Yes! Surf up fast! I love Frank's little dance too when he puts it on. I actually love the fact that he does like a little humming, just like. Hmm. <laughs> 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 yeah! This looks good! <laughs> oh, I just. This, this is probably why I love freaking. Also, right? the most Frank overrated like... joke of Capcom. Oh no! Jill sandwiches! No! <laughs> oh yeah! The freaking Resident Evil one joke needs to stop. There she is. Oh yes, the Jill Sandwiches. I don't know. You did not notice something. I, I did not notice that. I feel tempted to just pull that up just to hear it and then look over at Dead Rising just like, God damn it, Capcom! He wants some Jill Sandwich. I don't know if you guys have noticed this, but. Both of the Resident Evil characters are related to food because there is one that is called Jill Sandwiches, and in the food court there is one place called Chris Fine Foods. Oh no! I oh my god! god. Yeah, both of the Resident Evil characters have a food-related place here. You know here. what, Rexo? It took me that damn long to actually realize it. To this day, I did not know that Chris's Fine Foods was related to fucking Chris Redfield. <laughs> How many years have I been playing this game? I just don't realize this. I'm getting stuck again. The stupid Lanma, where is he from? Oh, goodness. Oh. <laughs> I really can't be disgusting. Uh, oh, you actually want to know what's the funny thing I really love about fight fighting Carlito? Yeah, there is. Yeah, there's Chris right. The fact works. that you can one shot him with a freaking sword. <laughs> ah! The freaking sword trick! Sword. Yeah, you swing once and he's like instantly dead, so if you're ever doing the infinite mode, you hit him with a sword, all you just hear. Ah! Dead. It's <laughs> 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 that full fledged scream he does that's hysterical. It's <laughs> so bad. No, the sword. One thing I don't understand is how in the hell can he do a kick that sends Frank spiraling in midair? That's what I really good for human kick of the app. Oh, so I hope you guys don't make good noise. I'm, I'm gonna pick up. I'm gonna make cooking some corn corn dogs. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Dang, I'm trying to find that one gif of Frank just throwing a fish at a helicopter and it kills the helicopter. Oh Wait, my god, Jim. <laughs> I'm trying to find that right now, but I can't. Could you please send that? That sounds beautiful. Oh yeah, god, quick step. That in, the, in the chat. I remember quick step, that stuff is just like super fun to use. Oh, it's yeah. a godsend. Yeah. For, there's a lot of people here who know the quick step for the Dead Rising 2. Well, this is the quick, the quick step for Dead Rising 1. Just look at this. Oh. It's a godsend. Yeah, look at this oh, one. Oh, he's using it, he's using it. Oh, just like. Wow, that was a good platform. Whoever <laughs> made this design made a crappy design. But hey, it gets things a little easier for fighting against zombies. Oh, I found it! I found it! Oh, oh, Christ. Right here, Carlito. I'm gonna look at oh, oh, I found it! <laughs> 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 Try that for sure. Special forces defeated. <laughs> 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 oh, 
how many tries did it take this person to get that? How many tries? I don't know, tries? but I love it. I love that they did this. <laughs> well, I, I've got to say this. I have to save the. Does someone just make it like an actual West. infinite looping glitch? <laughs> like gift. I feel like I miss it. Oh, so much easier to kill a helicopter with fish. I, tell you. But I, I just love that comment. It's arguably easier to destroy a, U, a UH-60 Black Hawk helicopter in Dead Rising by throwing some fish in. It's oh, so good. Good Oh, Frank West. <laughs> because it was not easy to be a psychopath. You, uh, you took a fire on his way and he will be dead. Oh, my yeah. God. <laughs> mm -hmm. I, just I just love the surfbot basket with the cutscenes. Let me just look at that. I know, it's so good. <laughs> <It's so> good. <laughs> <laughs> That's what that video is missing, a servbot mask! <laughs> that makes sense, you put a bread around, around this, this area. Oh my god, I love this game. <laughs> I love this game. Yeah, it's so good. The other thing yeah, that can... kind of ruin it is the AI intelligence, but it's a really good game. <laughs> of course, the AI is terrible. <laughs> I try. I'm not sure the AI is improved in a in, in a remake or or remaster. Oh, the Dread Rising remaster? Well, I'm playing the remaster and you're going to see that it's a You win, Frank. They are still idiots. Yeah, I'm kind of curious if, if they di did improve it. What, the remaster? Yes. Well, I do know that they actually did fix a uh, a very painful glitch that I actually experienced that made me stop the game oh, like playing the game years. Oh, the court in the yes. infinite. Seven uh, days. It happens on the final day, just to tell you, like just hours took from that it. Took picture in the entrance. Plaza. And it ended up crashing my game, and right I lost the front door. all that like seven hour or the eight hour plaza. worth of progress sure. there. That yeah, sucks. Uh, uh, and I never hey, even knew that, that glitch, so but to cover thankfully story? they fixed that. Or not? I've been yeah. hearing the Dead Rising <sighs> one in in hey, PC edition Steam. They do fix fix some bugs. Yeah, they did fix some bugs. Sadly, the only yeah. thing that they don't fix is the survivor's intelligence. But oh, yeah. I bet that's hard coded into the game. The only way you do that is you have to remake Dead Rising, for all we know. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You'd have to probably go through the entire game's files. For all I know, it's probably like the first file they put into the game, and they're just like, we're not screwing with this, we're just gonna leave it there for the rest of the game. <laughs> yeah. Oh, boy. Oh, just don't worry about it, the AI sucks. And I will probably do that, Shadow, I will be wearing random clothes for different cutscenes, probably, I don't know. Oh, Oh boy. No, I'm just oh, thinking of God. Frank West in that surf pop mask with the freaking like kid clothing. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, this is the real Mega Man Buster. Just look at this. Yeah. Now there just probably should be like a seven hour stream of Rexo trying to get the actual uh sword. Oh my yeah. god. I'm pain. Rexo, you should go for the sword. Oh yeah, I still remember that one time when I was actually doing this and I accidentally shot Brad with the Mega Buster and I think it actually one-shot him because he was in the head. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I wasn't aiming at the time, I was just randomly firing at zombies. One zombie did the little like downward and then swing his arm upward, he ducked the shot and hit Brad in the head and killed him. I'm just like, why? <laughs> because this game loves you. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I forgot this part. It's actually a survival on this part, but he didn't spawn because you're way too early. But I just realized Rex, oh, are you seriously running with that uh that freaking like lead pipe the entire time? Yes he has been. <laughs> <laughs> Is it actually funny that I actually prefer using the lead pipe oh, hey. or anything else more or less? This, this guy up here, you know yeah. the camera guy. Yeah, but I need to wait for this idiot who I think it's stuck at the beginning of the fucking area. This is why you give him something to help. He has a fucking gun! 
<laughs> he's talking oh to my god, Brad, he's moving! I don't even think you can, you can even interact with Brad, give him anything. Of course, I'm going to give him a room, room. Well, he might prefer if they get a gun. Oh my god, are you... <laughs> that air-headed AI is just getting caught in a corner. <laughs> I think he's so good. I might prefer the weapon they rather choose to have. Uh, also, for the best use, check out some weapons like like bats if 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 they're interested in ho holding a weapon. I'm actually now some wondering can't something. others would. Why do I imagine now if you give any NPC the real Mega Buster and they actually take it? Oh, they wouldn't yeah. take it. And they hit you, and one hit kills you by accident. Don't go. <laughs> <That's only. laughs> actually, now, Rexo, you're reminding me of something I actually saw one time on YouTube. It was uh, someone fighting against that uh, machete boss, oh. and he did the backstab, and it one-shotted his, like, seven health. Like, just <laughs> done. Oh, it dang. One hit. I'm just like, what in the world just happened? Yeah, I think Sir, some of the bosses actually do a lot of damage. For example... This whole thing up. No, I think I'm the balloon thing have the clowns for damage. That thing hurts like it's blocking it. It was a real threat. Oh my god, you're talking about Adam now. Well, you know what was Sir, sad that happened? Dr. Dr. Barnaby? I remember at one point dying to him because I, like, I didn't know how to fight him. It was my first time actually well, fighting him. So I thought of just shooting at him and I didn't know he blocked bullets. So I'm just like, oh crap, I'm screwed now. He, he ended turned up down killing my me, and it took me him. almost like Said the he isn't going to figure out like a whole strategy and everything. A secure route out of here. About a cut, like about a couple months ago, I found a video a of somebody killing HQ. Adam the Clown using the one of those toy blocks to to in the Toyland area. Just what? 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 <laughs> yeah, he can't block him when you're kicking that thing, so it just bounces off him, and he just gets sent into a spiral. But then he just completely out. I'm gonna find him. I I'm have to try that! Oh I'm the clown! <laughs> oh my god! I'm gonna try that when I have I'm to going... fight Adam for sure. We've been fighting him wrong this whole time! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Hold on, I'll find it for you. Uh... Yes, please! Do it. I fucking love this game series, it's so good. I just hope that it's still around because I have to pick No, I don't want to take the- I want to talk with him, I don't want to pick the apple. Thanks a lot. Okay, I, I think I might- oh, yeah, I found it. Oh, please share it. I, I found yeah. it. It is right there. Like, oh, yeah. Because if you went too far away from them while there's horde of zombies, he's gonna die easily. <laughs> That's the thing though. Actually, I think I probably should have just posted the part because it just shows the whole cutscene. You want to watch the full thing go to 150. That's when he actually starts to fight. But it's just beautiful that he just avoids fighting him directly and just jumps off, goes into the toys, grabs a little like cube and starts kicking it at him. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, but speaking of Adam the Clown, what did you guys think of the first time he actually dies? Rex, oh so my I god, the first time I saw that was so then? weird. Like, for your first time actually ever seeing that, what was your <laughs> initial uh, Like, I was holding myself. Yeah. I literally looked over and I'm just like, what in the world? <laughs> okay. I'll get you back. The fact that he just gets kicked and he just goes into like that spiral to the floor. Can you give him a weapon? <laughs> yeah, you give him a weapon for a moment. The one that I don't need right now. Awesome. But... Adam the Clown had intentions. He had good intentions. Don't it's get too, too bad far, we had to so... kill him. Yeah. Don't get too far on him. Yeah, that's what I'm waiting because <laughs> AI in this game is but... real stupid. Yeah, but Can you give him a quick step? And he's low. No, I give him a submachine gun because my katana broke. Oh, yeah, I still love the whole purpose of all of this in Dead Rising what you can make it be. Pretty much someone's comment right here on the video. Let me get this straight. A man wearing a Mega Man costume is fighting a killer clown with chainsaws in a mob full of zombies. What happened, Capcom? You used to be cool. <laughs> 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 you know, I'm I didn't mean used to be cool. This is great as shit right now. You know what it is? <laughs> the funniest thing? Mega Man fighting a clown. And then we got Mega Man 8 and we got Clown Man. Oh my god, you're, you're just reminded me of that now. 
Of course, you're also reminding me of Mega Man 8 Scream in one cutscene. And I'm just like, oh god, that is just an ear rape of a scream. I love oh it. Oh my god! I actually god. really love Mega Man 8, but it's just that cutscene with the voice actor. The voice actor is Mega Man 8. Is so but the fact that they mispronounced sword into sward. Sward man! Flame <laughs> sward! I mean sword <laughs> man. <laughs> oh my god, Beal, you actually surprised me. You you are so far a really good uh survivor. Oh, oh you're a little farther from Bill. Bro, you already forgot. Oh my god. God, that little block is such a weapon. Yeah, you see this, right? <laughs> it's such a weapon! <laughs> he can't fight back, he can't even block it or deflect it, he just gets knocked over. <laughs> the funny thing is that actually takes a decent I don't care what it is. I swear I'm gonna try that for sure when I have to try you that. Have to. You have to! You have to, please! The problem is the fact that his aiming... Oh god. <laughs> Like oh my god, Adam Billy's Adam stuck so now! I love how Adam can be so damn stupid. Just look at him! He's not Wait, moving, what? he's just letting himself get killed! <sighs> that's, that's the Dead Rising AI for you. CALL HIM! Gosh darn it! I call him, but he still gets stuck. Yeah, there's one thing I'm he's getting comboed, that's why! <laughs> okay, there. Now move, Bill. Stop bullets? getting stuck and just move. I like the fact yeah. that he just finished off freaking Adam with a punch to the face and he just kills him. <laughs> oh boy, I missed this game. I really should play it again. Oh my god. Of course, the sad thing is I only just got the recent version of the Xbox One. That's because that's how I used to play it, with the Xbox. Rexo, go when you get a chance, get that picture from Dead Rising off the record. Oh yes, I will. I actually Which have it right Rexo's now saved in, play my in the next stream. Computer. Of record or the regular one? Ah, it will be of the record because I don't know, but I feel that of the record is a more complete version than the, the writing two. Oh, okay. Oh but yes. The um, cannon. I, even though that that weapon right there. Is oh yeah, I forgot. Effective, Rexo, I love the kill from the it. Cannon part. He still has the full proof good sport around, I think. Isn't he actually annoying because he goes through like a whole camera tutorial for some reason? Like saying that you gotta get this PP shot and everything? Yes. Yeah, yeah I love that. Yeah. But you gotta those do it. Brutal. That death is like brutal for zombies. Just yeah, wrap yeah, him with a hook and then just before he disappeared because. Sorry. Because if you screw up his quest, you get some struggle fighting against him. I'm sorry for those who got spoiled. He's actually a boss as well. Oh yeah, hey Rexo, have you ever oh, done the uh, heavy attack for that weapon? For the... Sickle? The sight. And there's also yeah. a bonus one yeah, as well. Yeah, there is the normal one. If you do... Uh, I don't know why I actually love doing that like heavy attack, because if you just like cut a horde, and you just like kill most of them with just a leg swipe. That's a really... yeah, that's perfect for cleaning. Or, you know, invincibility oh, frames, because you could just hook onto them and no zombie could actually hit you. Exactly. While you're doing that, uh, that tug that just, like, kills them. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, that's always, uh, invincibility is always real good in this Oh kind of boy, game. I'm being reminded of how this game was a pain to deal with at the time. You wanna know what's coming oh, behind it? it's horrible. You guys remember that, uh, yeah, for spoilers real quick, that one oh. boss that had, not the boss, the psychopath dude that has the Molotovs, and you oh. have to put him out to save him? Yeah, I agree. I agree. Oh I hate the god! Fact that you could not oh, aim with yeah, the fire well. Yeah, I, I hate the fact that. Oh, he just saved you! <laughs> <laughs> He's just <laughs> saving my life, literally. Literally, all I just see you from the side of bullet go hit the zombie. Oh, okay. Chris, remember to take the Uzi from him. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> That's ton of zombie in the elevator. That's why I always hated the elevator. Oh, oh I hate that a quick time. Yeah. Of course, I also hate the fact that uh, you could accidentally hit a survivor trying Here, to shove a zombie off. Now give me the machine gun, and now let me drink some juice. Well, you're down only like like four four health now. Oh, you actually gave him a submachine gun. <laughs> yeah, he gave him the submachine gun. Yeah, because my katana just broke, so I had to improvise. Oh, no, I'm not gonna take the elevator, actually. I'm gonna he is take such the... a zombie. 
Yeah, Bill. Actually, Bill, hey, have Bill, you guys Bill, recently Bill, checked Bill, out that one Bill, channel Bill, that was Bill, talking Bill, about that science that guy? Hey, what channel? There was a channel that recently came out about this, like, one dude talking about the beta of Dead Rising and then actually going out into the parking lot. He, like, managed to get a whole bunch of versions of Dead Rising from the betas at E3 all the way up until the now current, basically, version of the game. Oh my and god. It, he actually, that sounds so good. Yeah, he. in fact, there were so many files. One of them really pissed me off. You want to know what it is? What? You can carry chainsaws in your inventory in that other uh, Oh my god, I'm uh, Oh my god. Uh, you literally could carry chainsaws in your pocket. <laughs> and they had it and they actually had a really sweet looking health bar that got changed for this. I mean the other one was like red that actually like goes down gradually when you're hit and it looks cool. Oh, that's also, I I really hate it. You're not too late. I really hated the Get hell of that kid's laugh. Oh, I, I don't know why I- Oh no, he got to shoot me if I do that. Kick him! <laughs> Actually, if I point at him- This is a kick! Actually, if, kick. if I point at him, he starts shooting me. I'm gonna try that. No, don't! Yeah. Save your game! Save your game, Bert! I hope he did save, save your game, Bert, so, or else he has to start over helping Bill again. Because I think you have actually- I think you actually have two. Let me see if I can show you that. I don't. I don't mind really. If I point at him, he can start shooting me. Don't do uh, it. Don't wrong do button. It. Save the game. Go save the game. You have plenty of time. Yeah, you, and then like the the bathroom is literally and like just, just up on high. Just downstairs. Yeah, I forgot. I like how I like how he gave you a smug right before that whole change. The heck? Fantastic. That's Great it. Great shot. Oh, I forgot to point at him. 489. Great shot. Fantastic. Oh, okay, there we go. There. 489, Great we're just two points off. <laughs> 11 <laughs> points. <laughs> 700. Oh, well, God. I always hated how random he wanted to make the. Oh, okay. Yeah, the Perfect okay, shot. <laughs> exactly 700, what you needed. <laughs> that ain't half bad. Then he just starts running away from you okay. because you pulled out your Uzi. Oh my God. Yeah, you have to see him the again first. in later part of the game. For people who don't keep a fighter, <laughs> this might <laughs> trigger saving another survivor as now well. This is my most yeah, there's actually two survivors I think you can actually shot. save there in his quest line. Oh, I can? Yeah, yeah. yeah. there's the guy that he has that he's gonna infect with little worm, shot. spoiler alert. And then there was another one. In the music uh -huh, shop uh -huh. right next to that toy toy okay. area, like okay. in the back, who I think was already infected, but yes. was actually the girlfriend of the guy getting infected, well, shot. close to getting infected. Check it out. Oh. Yeah, I played this uh. game a lot, so I'm just like, oh, so this happened here and that there. Okay, now okay. I get it. Here's the deal, as much as I want to spoil, if you don't do his quest, then he I he's definitely get, gonna be killing Survivor huh? without no letting you guys notice. Yeah. Wait, he so if he Survivor. Yes, he does. He did. Yeah, so if and... he didn't do his quest, then he'll definitely murder Survivor. Yeah. And he'll definitely give you a bad start fighting boss because you're gonna be in 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 chain fighting yeah. him. Yeah, and you have none of your weapons. You have to like literally grab anything around you and just like fight him. And he's just doing the freaking super kick that takes three health to hit. A yeah. Really lovely start. It's a really pain. Two people hiding inside. Oh God! Barricade pair. I remember doing that. You have to literally, uh, beat, the in, you have to literally beat the snot out of totally one cool. guy to get them to like get them out of their like crazy like. Don't do it in the mega buster. I did it once. <laughs> and what a big mistake! <laughs> Why would you? I don't With know. I was I like, oh, I have to beat the shit out of you. Mega buster. Them. Oops, he's dead. <laughs> oh, the mega buster. As much as it's a fun weapon, it's a pain in the ass. Exactly. It's just Quick step. Uh, wait, uh, what time hey, is the Shadow game? Dragon there and Chad actually agrees there with what we have to deal with when it comes to Ken. Yeah. Yes. Everybody hates this, like, <laughs> little quest line, but when he's actually dead, it's just like, oh, okay, no more having to deal with that. Okay, But it doesn't matter if you if you get <clears throat> killed early part of the game. If you do get him killed, then, then there's no way to save that survival as well. Yeah. Because they just won't appear. So you got him to yeah. keep him alive till... Actually, now, now I'm trying to think. Uh, actually, there is one thing I do want to talk about. What do you guys think about the boss's themes? Oh, Big ass. Actually... Adam McCloud did it got the most... 
they, awesome bomb they were awesome. Well, it's also a team in Mario vs. In Dead Rising well. oh, yeah. 3, they went I down. Speaking of which, I still like the fact that Frank West was actually in that uh, Marvel vs. Capcom. And I do like the fact that in his trailer, you can see him literally going up against the Hulk. <laughs> And also the I mean, why wouldn't he? The funny thing about Frank West is that the team, his team is actually Adam the Clown from the fight. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's, that's something I cool. really like about it. Gosh darn it! <laughs> I know! Gosh right? darn it! Get out of the way! I'm <laughs> inside, I think. Wait, what? Hey, pizza! Get out of the fucking way! Pizza. You're the wet zombie! Wet sir bot! What? Oh yeah, the second. Yeah, here I'm gonna one. beat your ass. Okay, now take it. Actually, if there's one thing I actually really like from the second one, I'm actually stuck either between the freaking that cook theme or. <laughs> oh my god, Rex! <laughs> oh, he just like whacked. <laughs> I like how this this, this kind of like looks like one of those like oh one side of fight. It's like you have to. It's like try to lose most of the hell. Don't try to kill him. Just make him lose his hell. That's yeah, that's what he's trying, trying to do. To do. Okay. Looking mercy at you. Like like give up. Yeah. Oh, there was, he is. <laughs> I was not expecting the shell will do that much damage. <laughs> <laughs> I just <laughs> hit him by accident, and I was not expecting. Feed him milk. Just feed him milk. Uh, this Trish, is awesome. it's okay. Just drink my milk. Oh, this yeah. is why I love this. Yeah, drink my meal. It's warm and creamy. <laughs> okay. That's so boring. <laughs> 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 no, I'm not done it. Everyone, just come and talk to me. Gotcha. Okay, take my you got it. thing. Uh, bird. You give Aaron a weapon. Gotcha. Hey, yeah. hey, hold on. Bird doesn't have a weapon. Yeah, I, I gave him a katana now. Give him the left pipe! Oh, okay, because I noticed that his face was awesome. that was there. Oh, yeah, I realized giving a survivor any sharp weapon is damn good for them for their survival. Oh, yeah. Come on. Of course, I really like it when you can oh, my God. arm them oh. with the chainsaw. Oh, thank you. Oh, ow, damn it, Bert. Well, thank you. Follow me! Come on, guys. <laughs> oh. I think there's also another survivor around this area, I think. Yeah, uh, but it still not, oh. doesn't spawn yet. But for that it's... survivor, I rather escort uh, her along. Yeah, isn't it the woman in the jewel shop? What is the oh, other? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, the one who can't walk because uh, wasn't she? Actually, wasn't she the no. from like the intro of the game? No. There is. I found a woman in the jewelry shop in Alfresco Plaza. She's moving around an awful lot. Yeah, that's the lady. But I want to score these guys first because... For real? Yeah. It's the same lady from the trailer? No, that's what I'm thinking because... That's what I originally thought because... Like, just one woman there who said that their kid died and I assumed it's probably the one from the, like, intro, but I, I'm i probably wrong as hell for all I know. It's, it's a just... baby, first of all. Yeah. And second of all, everyone in the intro is dead. Okay, the reason why I want to me, it's score rude. these I two guys... Oh, at, 6 PM, at 6 p.m. Uh, the convicts is going to spawn and it will make hard to call survivors to this Oh uh, god, the convicts. Exactly, oh, so I better I wait. Hate I hate them because they keep respawning, but I mean the good thing is they dropped that machine gun! Exactly, so I'm gonna wait for the mission of the Wonderland oh. Plaza so I can unlock the secret passage. <laughs> Thing. What is that? I got the machine gun. I remember I was trying to kill I don't know what, and the survivor from that part, like the girl, got in my shot and I accidentally killed her in one hit. Oh my oh god! god. <laughs> she literally ran in front of me to hit a zombie. Oh my god! Because... And pop, one head, one headshot, and it was just I like, know it's, right. over there. You no. go there. Oh, this is a fun Aaron, game. just stop getting stuck and run! <laughs> Motherfucker. <laughs> See, the, good, <laughs> the good way that you actually uh, help Aaron or anyone who's stuck in the horde, just run into the horde and disrupt all the zombies oh, in them. Hey. Yeah, don't even do anything. Just, can't even, can't just even run. run. Okay, you just like slightly tap them. There you go. They're cousin, they're cousin. Run. Wait, did he just hit his friend? Possibly. Yeah. 
They aren't really the best. Oh, oh, I? oh wait, never mind. I was gonna think, why not just get like them both the uh, submachine guns and just give it to them both? Oh come on. Come here, come here. Okay, they're coming. Clap. Over there! Okay. Oh yeah! I still remember like all the skills in this game. I love the disembowel ones, just straight up punch and gun, rip gun out, push zombie away. <laughs> <laughs> it's such a silly move. But I also love the yeah. fact that you can do that on survivors. Oh, you can do it! <laughs> yes, you can, but it doesn't oh kill God. them instantly. Yeah, it just hurts them a lot. Funny thing, you know that, uh, the first two survivors you actually supposed to save, I accidentally did it to the woman there. <laughs> <laughs> you just, just did the gun, just like rip her gun. I'm just like, oh shit, sorry. <laughs> you just made it impossible for her to give birth. <laughs> Wow! Oh. <laughs> that was so weird, that <laughs> so cool. Oh yeah, I remember those hornets that you had to like find at the, uh... The queens! Yeah. Okay, now oh, time okay. to drink. Now let's queens. wait for, uh... The problem is now the queen sometimes... No, he hasn't fought to... Adam yet. Not yet, Ch no. Cello. He probably no, should, not, but almost. because it, we, we showed him... bullshit! The queen is so high, I can grab Oh her. my god, this <laughs> queen does not want to get caught. <laughs> What the hell is? <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. That's why I kind of wish we could just punch in the air. You could just swat him to the floor and just pick him up. <laughs> oh, actually, speaking of which, you guys haven't seen this yet, but Rexo is probably going to fight Adam the Clown from the way that I actually showed him a video, okay. which he's going to be using a toy block from the uh, the plaza and just constantly kicking it at him. I'm gonna have to look at that. I'm gonna take a oh, mannequin man. with me because actually <laughs> someone showed me that mannequin also do a lot of damage to psychopaths. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why. <laughs> object to use attack. Oh my god, you can't be serious. Does the mannequin seriously do more damage to psychopaths? Well, apparently a friend actually ex told me that. He had some videos of people beating psychopaths with mannequin or mannequin torso and do a lot of damage. So I'm gonna try that too. Actually, I should probably just mention the cello that in the uh, media share, it should have the uh, <laughs> the video there of Adam just getting his ass headed to him by someone in a with a freaking toy block. By toys. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> Just a kid toy thing it. from the Also, the fact that that toy is way more effective than like most of the things you actually use on him because- Oh, what? I can save the mannequin so sweet! Oh hey, police! Maybe you can pick up a gun and give it to the survivor. Actually, now that you say that, there is a funny thing I have to try, uh, what is the name of the psychopath on the mall? Which mall? Uh, Which the side? One, the one who is like, No one can my store! Oh, oh I think that's oh. Carl. Okay, there is someone who actually told me that if you stand in a corner and when he pops up, you attack him with a stun gun, in five to six seconds he's dead. What? I'm gonna try that because someone. You can need to try it because I don't know this. I don't I know either, either and I want either. to try that. I need to see this. I also want to try that. <laughs> you're, uh, you're gonna use the nectar for the, uh. Yeah, I'm gonna be Just using for health. Nectar because the queens are actually really useful in case survivors get surrounded Stop. by zombies. Yeah, yeah, and you know what? I only want to shoot them with Russell. the Mega Buster. There is. You do definitely don't want to do that. That's the fucking guy. I wonder if Rex. I wonder what other costume Rexel has to fight. Oh, Steven. Oh, no! Steven! Guys, he's doing the he's doing the fight with the convict. You can actually skip these guys and escort the the survivor away from these guys if you can. It's a pain in the ass to deal with though. Yes, it is a pain. Oh boy, not Oh no, the guy. Okay, because I really don't want to risk to lose the survivor. This probably will be the only exception. When if things go horribly wrong, I'm gonna use- Well that killed him! They're actually There's no there. way of saving him! Yeah, there's sadly no way of saving him. I'm gonna use this yeah. just right now, I don't want to keep I just love that fa- I just love that freaking Sir Bob Mask face like- What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> They're already- Did they get stuck? 
<laughs> they got stuck! Amazing! Oh, oh I don't think they did Wait, they got stuck? stuck? Yeah, they're stuck! They got stuck! <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, they got stuck in the tree! And now they're dead! It's because I don't want to read the kills off me, so I'm gonna have to do it. Oh, boy. Me. Uh oh. Uh oh. I say oh. I don't want to do the Mega Buster Ring because I don't want it to kill someone. Okay, that's perfect. You wanna know some funny part? <laughs> you wanna know some funny part about you. this, uh. <laughs> There's one thing that's funny about this fight is the fact that you can actually shoot that uh the vehicle enough times to actually make him get stuck in place. Me. Come on, Sophia! Oh. So so <laughs> she just looks like She's a. She's running in place. Oh my god! <laughs> Don't tell me, Sophie, She can't get into the vehicle. Okay, she can't get into the vehicle. What? Okay, she is in the vehicle. Okay, at uh, the first time he doesn't want it to go up. Oh yeah. Okay. You gotta love the way. You gotta love so the view when you're driving on the dead body on the back seat. Ride? Oh, she so can now. Oh my gosh, she just teleports in. <laughs> Don't mind me, just driving with a dead body in the back seat of the car. I wonder if we're gonna take that machine gun there. These chairs are un in indestructible. But yeah. <laughs> You guys actually know that you can actually like destroy the vehicle and actually make like have all three of them still alive and they're just there doing nothing. <laughs> so you just like destroy the vehicle, it just does absolutely nothing. Oh. I uh... She's okay. close enough. Yeah. Okay. So what the <laughs> Yeah, let me just reach it up, take the whole machine gun off. That no big deal, it's not heavy or anything. Yeah, this is <laughs> Okay, this is where I'm gonna use a queen because now I'm getting surrounded and Sophie's getting attacked. Oh god. Oh, I have to hold her hands. Okay, come here. <laughs> oh no! She no. just gets bitch slapped! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! No, why? <laughs> Oh my god, this is, this is such a fun game. Oh, I miss this game. <laughs> I miss playing this game for the first time and wondering what the hell's going on. That seems to be cute you said you're holding her hands. Uh, yeah, it's funny. Totally looks like when, it, when, when a survivor is feeling too scared to 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 Do anything. travel. This might happen a couple, couple times throughout Resident Evil 1 and 2. Come on! Oh, Come on, Sophie, move. I don't wanna hold your hands anymore. You can deal with that here. Let me just bury knife these zombies. Yeah. Oh, get out of here. Okay, there. Come here, Sophie. You're Careful! Okay. Elevator! Woo! You know what I'm actually quite surprised many... about? That knife is so Follow damn effective me. on just killing them. How many times do these zombies get inside of elevators? I. No. All the damn time. Yeah, every time you open the fucking elevator, there will be zombies. I like the fact that you guys just went up an elevator with a zombie still coming up. <laughs> yep. And we're yeah, fine. Another downside on this part of area, right near from the security room vent, I think the zombies will spawn right there around outside on the rooftop. Okay, she never got the chance to say what to him. <laughs> how she feels, I think. Uh oh. Yeah. He never had a chance to tell me how to so. feel. I don't know how these <laughs> zombies are like, I never had a chance to tell him how to feel. I want to be bars! <laughs> oh, now the elevator's <laughs> empty? Yeah, now Watch, really I bet you if you go back there and you open the elevator, zombies gonna be there. Yeah, there will be zombies. Just for some damn reason. Exactly. Are you gonna save the lady in a duty story, Rexo? Yeah, I'm gonna do that. But it's yeah, because I want to right. to deal first you guys, you guys wanna know what's actually the worst achievement to get? If you don't know how to do it properly, Frank the pimp. Even worse. Oh. Having to answer all of Otis's calls without interrupting. Oh shit! That's oh god! And considering the effectiveness of the D-pad, it will literally just cause you to hit that and then accidentally hit something else that ends his call. Yeah, I'm gonna do that, Shadow Dragon, actually. Oh my god! Oh, it look at this time. bullshit! It's night time! You, you should have saved the jewelry woman! You know what happens? Because if not, I'm gonna explain you. 
Oh, you dropped an item in that cutscene and then they disbanded. Oh, it. No, I drink the nectar so I can get a bee. The cutscene interrupted and the bee never came. Yeah, oh I disbanded. it. Gosh, fucking darn it, game. <laughs> uh, I wasted so a nectar. Well, I mean, to be honest, nectars are easy to get in this. I so know, but it's annoying. Good, but I know the, I know. It's just, it's just so bullshit at that. It's like, why? Don't save the game. What the hell is this? Okay, uh, I'm gonna put this for a while, and after that, I'm gonna. Don't save the game, game, also. Yeah, I actually, I have to go save the game. Got the yeah, it makes your Okay, yeah, you Teddy Ruxpin. <laughs> I'm gonna be a Teddy for now before I put the Goblin Man. Teddy Ruxpin, the wait, talking wait, bear! Oh, yeah, I just noticed something. You can actually shirt. give a character, <laughs> your survivor, a piggyback ride. Yeah. Oh, yeah! That's only if they're like, they got an injured leg. Like, for or, example, you know, these like ladies. That one <laughs> I'm actually thinking of the uh, the dude from the uh, shoe store when you actually do that thing, have to fight Adam the Clown. He can, uh, those two actually have a chance of being there at the same time. I think they have a chance. Oh, the, guy, the guy who's like almost near dead and he's like full bandage yet he has to like limp. Oh god, that was. Oh uh, god, that one is so tough. Yeah, I know. And they're literally like all the way across the mall. Yeah. Oh, I forgot my corn drops already. Is, is it kind of uh, like weird to figure out that technically. Anyone there? Actually, wait, no, that's spoilers. I'm not going to say anymore. Don't spoil the oh, game until we I get there. Back in <laughs> I think it's going to take us a couple hours to actually get there. <laughs> I know, I know, but still. <laughs> I gotta eat my corn oh, dogs. Boy. If that's the one thing I dish. seriously kind of like slash dislike about this game is the time system, but that's what made Dead Rising basically just Dead Rising. Exactly. The only problem it's of this game is so the, good. The time is really short in this game. Thankfully, they picked out on the second game. But in the, the second first game, game and third. Really, really short amount of time. Yeah, but I, one thing I really like is either being on time. Compared to accident, like getting there early and having time to kill off, quote unquote. Don't you have the lariat move, Rexo? What? Don't you have the lariat? Oh god. Oh yeah, that, I have the, the lariat. Move. The moment where you do the spin and anything in your hand goes flying like a rocket. <laughs> yes! yes. How do I don't you just do that when you're surrounded. Uh, better, better yet, you want to the most effective way with that? Press left stick, okay. And press X, okay, let's see. Okay, that's what you do. Okay. Yeah, also, the, the one thing I find fun about that move is the fact that if you do it with a proper weapon, it's just gonna cut through things like a freaking whirling blade. Just like. <laughs> 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 it's did you do it with a laser, laser sword? Oh, <laughs> I didn't Oh my god, don't choke me, lady! No, she's gonna do that. What? Is she choking you? Oh my god! Yeah, it's, it's animation. <laughs> She's choking the bear! Yeah. yeah to give you a close look to this lady. Nah, I probably couldn't Wait, even is this really the same lady from the, from the intro? I don't think so. No, no it, it isn't. isn't. It, it's someone else. I, I thought, thought it was so originally nice. because I never really watched the intro. I no, he's not a different lady. Everyone from the intro is dead. Yeah. Everyone you know is dead. <laughs> that is technically true. Yes, this is my baby! Help me. Let me find a baby blue lady, but then we can do something for play safe. You know what will be cool if I can carry a survivor in a shopping cart? Oh my god. Oh, you mean like hell? Oh my god, I'm oh, oh my gosh. Yeah, I feel so sorry to leech. To Leia. <laughs> Yes, it's extremely sad what happens to her, but oh my god, you just turn the mood around by calling her leech. Yeah, just totally bust our, our mood. I'm trying to say I mean, it could be possible just adding a C in there, there you go. <laughs> Look at this picture, a big teddy bear carrying a big lady.
Hey, I mean, yeah. it is better than a surf bot mask guy talking to a government agent about a, like, just some doctor. <laughs> 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 so I feel so sorry to this lady since he lost her child oh, and, yeah. and getting eaten by the zombies. Actually, that was a, now that you mentioned that like it, a, that's I a guess. mother's nightmare. That's the thing. I was about to say it's a nightmare. Also, thanks that you mentioned that, but that's something I have to agree with Chella. But if you look at all the psychopaths, this guy of the machete is the only one who actually makes sense because. He got mad because he also lost his family in the zombie outbreak. Yeah, basically he just kind of went mad. Exactly. But the other doesn't he was also a Vietnam war veteran. Yeah. yeah. Plus, so he of... knew what he was doing. Thankfully, there is no Vietnam flashback. Technically, that was. Oh, well, okay. I explain... Yeah, to be glad this lady didn't try to kill you because that explained why she was choking you. Yeah, and he's just show he's just explaining just the animation, it looked like he's trying to show. Imagine if that actually hurts you. That would be oh. funny. Yeah. Talking about oh, hurt you. Uh, had you guys seen this game called um, Paper Mario Color Splash? Oh my no. god. Apparently uh, there is a part in this game where you have to hear some toads uh, getting mad at you. There is twelve toads and each of them uh, hurt you one HP when while he go to you and and shout at you. If you have really low life, they can kill you by just shouting at you. Are you serious? Yeah. Just look. But then again, that game you could have like two hundred HP. Yeah. Oh wow. But it's funny yeah. because you can imagine the idea of being killed by a toad that go to you and start telling you that he's put his sleep and he's bought too or things like that. You literally get killed by stupid things that the toad is saying. Okay, Leia is fine. For Leech. Adam the Clown crazy. had a good reason for being a psycho. Because it's just that we had to kill him. No. He did what he did because he wanted to protect the children. <laughs> Except those, uh. Were those even really children or were they just dolls? He had a good reason. It's not. <laughs> <laughs> He's still a psycho, though. Okay, yeah, and, you did, you, and you're still gonna have to like throw a box in his face. <laughs> <laughs> Rexo, I think as soon as they reach past that little ledge and into the fenced area, you can just go into the vent. Yeah. Oh my god, the fucking cultists. Oh no! Oh hey! You're gonna have fun with them. Oh god, yes. Also, logic, you can drop from this high with your knee and you will be fine. Yeah, that's actually one of the uh, tips that they actually gave out when Dead Rising like, released. They just said, hey, do this, you're gonna survive, like, basically fall from the Empire State Building. <laughs> yeah, just do a knee drop. You won't oh, break your knees yeah. at all. Basically, falling at a much more faster speed to the floor actually doesn't hurt you. Exactly. <laughs> Try it in real life. Maybe it works. No, uh, oh no, don't God. try Maybe it. Maybe you'll yeah. end up a pancake on the floor. Exactly. Speaking yeah, of those cultists, now, now that you're talking about the cultists, I'm now remembering how much of a pain they were to deal with, like for the first time, when they could eat insta spray you, oh. and you're like out cold instantly. Yeah, you want to avoid that at all costs. Yep. Okay, right I mean, I yeah, they are that. slow as- I mean, they are slow as hell, but... Oh my god, they're annoying. They are annoying. Also, I think if they blow you up, they also oh, wait a means... minute, uh, weren't you supposed to be doing that photo challenge? Oh, I already- thanks to mention that, but I already have it saved here, in some pictures. There is oh, one... you already have the pictures? Yeah, I already have the picture. I have a better one, that is 161. One, one. huh. Oh, okay. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know what to do since there's no survivor needing help. Any oh else that I thought it actually. Uh, oh, uh, you know what? There is exactly there is no survivor right now. So what I'm probably going to do is uh, just gonna create another hector probably, and I'm gonna go to the gun shop. Oh no! You're gonna deal with the heavy ass knockback. I'm gonna deal with that. Freaking Cletus! Oh. I think that's what his name was. Yeah. Oh yeah! The one dude who for some reason has the power to put like 10,000% knockback on a shotgun. Yeah. Whereas you shooting him does nothing, with the, even with the shotgun. 
Yeah, but the short one I'm gonna stay. Because I don't want to risk. The good advantage of that is at least if I do that, I like, will have almost free access to weapons to my survivors and give them all shotguns. And probably that is kill true, me because that's what happened once actually. Let me tell you that funny story. Oh. One time I was escorting a lot of survivors and I had a great, the brilliant idea of give all of them shotguns. I get, grabbed, <laughs> I get grabbed by a zombie by accident when I was trying to score them, and I get attacked by a bullet, by a rain of bullets, and I die. Oh wow! Well. <laughs> all for the for the brilliant of the hour gave them all of them shotguns. This is why I gave only one of them a shotgun, and everyone else either a melee or one pistol. Yeah, I, I was like, okay, I'll give you shotgun. Actually, hey. Yes. Isn't the cultist stuff also a good thing too? Because once you beat the uh, cultist leader, you can get that book. Yeah, that just the, makes the, the brainwashing book. The brainwashing book, as no, it's called. This oh, night. okay. Oh, cello is me. Cello is BRB, so I'm gonna take the chance. Because cello is BRB, I'm gonna do the this guy. But now Adam the clown is available. Oh, you're right. Oh. Yeah. So I'm gonna do this guy, and after that I'm gonna go for Adam, so Cello can see who I, if I can kill him with a block. No! Oh, at least you have to try and like save before you go to him, and then just like do like just random like testing of it. Yeah. Okay, what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna try to be this guy legit. Oh, hmm? no, 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 actually I'm gonna go first for Adam, because there is a weird bug that I'm going to explain to you guys. You can go with a melee weapon, and sometimes even if you hear the sound of you hitting him, the light doesn't go down. It's like the game box and it doesn't register the hit. Wait, are you talking about uh, Cletus? Adam. Cletus, yeah. Oh, yeah. Cletus? I, I sometimes don't think the hit doesn't get with the chainsaw. Yeah, I'm gonna kill him with the chainsaw, because sometimes the hit with the katana or with any weapon doesn't get registered. And even no, if you no, get the... that boss. That boss that uh, Shadow Dragon's actually talking about was actually very obnoxious to deal with. Oh god, her. I was thinking about her. Oh god, yeah. <laughs> oh, she's such a pain. I hate the fact that that tase lasts for like the full five or six seconds. It's true. I'm just gonna keep spamming you with the car wreck, so you'll be like, Hey, listen! Oh, there he yeah. is. <laughs> You. If you can mod, tell you. can you imagine okay. the idea of modding the game and the sound of the radio will be that? Hey, listen! That would be perfect. Oh. Why does Frank have a limp? Because he got hit so many times. So many recently. times. <laughs> like even that'll, before. That'll be this. perfect for Otis if you mod his. If you mod the. Okay, so first okay. I'm gonna grab a radio. Is that a vagina? Okay, I can save a cube. So I'm gonna okay. take a cube, and I'm gonna take another cube. I'm sorry, I just I just saw this inflatable bear... ...kids... thing. Oh, that... Just, funny, that, that looks like this. It's starting to remind me of that, that vagina Pikachu bouncing house. Yeah, that little what? block right there. Press X with that, and you'll just like kick it like a soccer ball. So that's oh what basically God. you I use to kill. I just had a weird moment looking at that thing. Oh, okay, thank you for letting me know. Okay, I'm gonna try that. I look, say that bunny, already. isn't it? Isn't that a bunny? Yeah, it's, it's actually a bunny. a bunny. And looks like the one from Silent Hill. Yeah, I was gonna, gonna say, <laughs> it's Robbie the bunny. You know what? <laughs> I said a bunny has a vagina. <laughs> hmm. Whoa, okay. A yellow vagina. Oh! Sorry. Right, so... Give it a good camera shot. Look at this. Does this look like a vagina to you guys? Kind. To be honest, like first look, it just looks like a butt to me. But now you're saying that it's just like, why would you say something? Yeah, that? if you guys remember that. Why oh, would you? Oh, yeah, I'm you actually know? quite surprised that the game just drops five zombie cops all armed with pistols there. <laughs> just for you, so when you're fighting okay, Adam. Chinese. And uh, let me look for the final uh, magazine because I think it's in here. Uh, I don't remember. Skateboarding. I'm gonna check right now my list during the Adam cutscene. Oh yeah, skateboarding! Rexo, that would be really good for you to skateboard. It'll be a lot yeah. faster if you travel, but only 
when you don't have any survivor with you. If you, if you do skateboard while a survivor with you, you might left them behind. Mm. Yeah, they'll just get stuck. But the funny thing that I really like about the skateboard is it's low durability, and when you accidentally break it in the middle of the board, you just do a little hop. <laughs> <laughs> you're just like, dish, 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 hop. Time for the favorite psychopath of everyone. All right, good luck with this. Let's see. You say Here it comes. Tell us about that. Not Miles. I'm sorry. <laughs> That Teddy rocks me. I'm gonna rejoice I because I think I'm like actually... terrifying many people who who, who fought against him. He it's dead like... for him. Oh, he looks like eight. <laughs> oh. <laughs> He's not Pennywise. How he triggered becoming psychopath by seeing children getting eaten. That's how he became a psychopath. He wanted to protect the children. Yeah. Yes. There's also no survivor is in the ride, so you have to save him as well. If you don't beat Adam and when he disappeared, he, he'll become a zombie fine when you find him around the kids area where Adam is. So if you didn't do Adam's boss, then you'll see the survivor is already dead and, and he became a zombie. You know what, speaking of uh... Speaking of now, zombified survivor, you guys ever got that achievement where you actually, or I think it's an achievement, where you find Brad at... Oh. Yes, it is an yeah. achievement. Yeah, there's an achievement. I'm try I, you know, that's the one achievement I could never. Oh, he jumped down. Oh, wow, that. All right, that's... good luck with them. Kick, kick, luck. The freaking, kick the freaking cube at him with this. <laughs> okay. 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 Kick a cube because oh, he just fell. <laughs> 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 he fell off. Yeah, he fell off. He jumped off. Like, okay. <laughs> okay, <laughs> oh, shit, I'm failing. I'm bad at kicking cube. <laughs> it's so good! <laughs> you can't stop it, not even with the chainsaw! <laughs> oh, no. ah. oh shit! Hey, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god! Here! Oh, come on, you ass! Stop jumping, my cue! He ball? He destroyed the ball! How do you oh, come on! I, my aim is <laughs> But at least we know that it actually hurts him. Yeah, it actually hurts him. <laughs> okay, take him. Oh, stupid <laughs> zombie! <laughs> okay, Adam, take him. Wow, Gosh darn it, you big clown! <laughs> now I oh, see yeah. why Beanie hates clowns. By the way, you want to know what you can actually do with him? If he's actually doing that, uh. Oh, lights went off. Yeah, the, the whole place. That freaking jump, that's not. Yeah, it's been there. I'm gonna need my cube. I'm really scary when the lights went off and everything looks so dark. You Did make it seriously have just hit your cube, Brian? Yeah. Yeah, he literally hit my cube. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, that would be really scary if the lights went off and everything is too dark to see. Okay, I have, I have two more cubes. Adam, and that'll be more terrifying for me if I'm gonna find him. <laughs> that'll be. Oh, we oh, start shooting Adam. Okay, he's over. Oh my God, my aiming with the cube sucks. I love that the cube was inside that store. Well, I, I'm wondering how it is. Wait, did you break the glass with the cube? I'm failing yeah, all did. my kicks with the cube. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Speaking of which, oh you know my god, you did. Thing? You know what I really love about this game best. when fighting oh my god. Yeah, what is it? I just love the fact of. Hold on. I just love the fact that when you actually hit him when he's blowing the freaking balloon, there's a chance that he'll do that fire thing and he'll blow the balloon in his face. <laughs> oh, I didn't do that! <laughs> he needs to be blowing yeah, the balloon. Those balloons are at an explosion. Okay. Yep. <laughs> you got it. Ouch. Okay, I feel, I feel like that's enough goofing around on Adam. Let's try it. Okay, to let's try the go. mannequin and see if Chill is right and he do that all time. Ow! Oh, oh, cool. oh gumballs! I want some gumball. Okay, I'm Are you I, trying I, to I, humiliate him with you? Hey, there oh, it is! He did it! <laughs> oh my god, he threw knives! I don't know if he can throw knives at you. Oh! Yeah, he can! That double hit with the fire! <laughs> I know, that was terrible! Jeez, up like time! <laughs> oh my god! There we go. What the f- How did you do- What? <laughs> the mannequin is working! Oh my god! <laughs> Dang! <laughs> what? 
Dude, what? Oh, no, not the seat again! And you just shove your ma like hand in your mouth, okay. That's the creepiest scene you can Oh see. my gosh. Is it more creepy than his laugh, how it just gradually gets lower in pitch? Like a possessed clown? Yeah. Oh my hey, gosh. Give up that, like, evil There's a card. There. Ooh. Oh. Oh yeah, pick up oh, a chainsaw. Oh here. my god. Oh, Sorry everyone. Sorry, Joe. I'm going to make sure we're going to tell you your name. Yeah, uh, I was about to say, pick up the chainsaw before you actually switch. Oh. Because you can get a second chainsaw here. Yeah. And you actually say someone. It I'll did a lot of damage. Yeah, that's what I mean, I don't it know. It murdered him. I mean, it took like what? A good chunk of his health. Like I saw it was at half HP. Next thing you know, like quarter gone. And he's yeah. like like a sliver of health left. And not only that, but also I noticed that every hit of the mannequin drove into the floor. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah the mannequin was just too strong. Yeah. Oh god, these things. Get away, get away, get away! The worms! Well, the green ones are annoying! Worms! Don't oh, you dang, just dang. love when they jump up at you? That was a zombie looked like him. Call me, dude. Okay, don't call me, I don't care. Oh yeah, I need to get close yeah. to this guy. If not, he's going to be like, Frank! Okay, I'm too far away. Actually, since he's the no. S, I think he's like the, uh, not the escort one, but he's the uh, one that you actually have to follow. Also, yeah. I think you should heal up, you only got four health. Oh, right, actually, I need to heal. <laughs> Wait, he just punched a zombie? Yep. Fantastic. <laughs> I thought you were actually gonna hit him. <sighs> what? You're standing literally right see. there. Analyze, analyze, analyzing break. <laughs> This is guys want to save any playthrough. Because so of that, he promotes incredible. Oh, okay, Rexo, so I think Greg can 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 take you to his shortcut. Yeah, That's he's going to take you. Yeah. Also, there is a Chinese guy. Chinese oh, guy. Were you talking about those tourists? Yeah, the tourists. Yeah. The tourists. Oh, okay. there they are. Shinji yeah. and you. Oh yeah, be careful. If uh, getting them both along with Greg, they can actually die. One of them can actually Why? die. Why? Oh because god! They will just get hoarded when you're trying to have a, a conversation with those tourists. So you better hold. Uh... And since Greg is only set on a path to the uh, bathroom, he's not gonna move unless you follow him, and he won't follow you until you reach the other plaza. Oh god! Greg, right there, as you can. Can you come back for the tourists then? Uh, yeah. What I originally did was I went to the other plaza and made him follow me. Then I just basically forced him to stay inside of uh, the bathroom the entire time. Oh, okay. I forced Greg to stay in there, and then I went, and then I made my way there. What? Okay. Oh, you just hit Greg. Yeah. Oh, I no! I oh just, geez. I just come for the food. What do you got against Greg? Perfect. I got all the three bugs. Now I have really gigantic chainsaw. Oh my oh, God! Zombie is attacking you. Awesome. No, I don't want to read the magazine, I want to see the magazine. Okay, okay, there. Okay, now I have a cool change. Yeah, you gotta read the magazine. You need the... Don't you need the... Japanese magazine? I these two guys. Yeah. You... I also need a Japanese magazine, but I'm waiting for Greg, because he's being... You from Persona 4? You, Hakamura, is not in here. No. Yeah, I'm kidding. I don't think I don't okay, have time for can take any weapons, and Shinji, not as good, but pretty decent. I know, Greg, shut up. Shut fuck up, Greg. Wow. I forget what does the three books mean meant for. What? It, it's oh, triple okay. layered. That means now I can hit. It lasts for 2, 27 times longer. Yeah, I can hit 2,000 2, zombies with this. Awesome. Yeah. Oh, thank you, Greg. Now I can come here. And now you can follow me back. So I can go for that Chinese. Yeah, just, just, just like force him to look like stand in the there. back where uh, zombies won't be, but at least give him a melee before you leave. Just in case a zombie thinks the friend is wandering there. Okay, that's a good idea. Uh, as far as it is, but Greg, don't worry. Have a chainsaw. 
I appreciate I was that. actually thinking you were gonna throw the chainsaw at him. <laughs> 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 Lay on Twitch. You just say, here, Greg, have a chainsaw. You just look up to the chainsaw, aiming at the gun. I know, you're about to give him a nice chainsaw. Greg from Darby the right into his face. <laughs> <laughs> Anywho, time to save these people over there at the bookstore. Yeah. Uh, I recommend probably. So if you got any spare melee that you give at least one of the melee and just like the other guys don't give him nothing. Actually, I can give them one at a time and the other another survivor. Chain, if I'm gonna pick another one. As I'm analyzing these survivors, you, is that his name? You, Who yeah, why are you you? Helper to you guys. Oh you my guys. god, I'm a fucking idiot. You can fight out the zombie uh, along. Eh, uh, you will see. Wait. Shinji, not the, not the brightest character survivor to have with you, but not for the best you have to... Wait, did you just use that like it's... <laughs> yeah, I, yeah. Grabbed, I grabbed the queen and I actually am throwing again. No! I was saving oh, it wow. for these cards. But I promise I actually am. That, that thing that Shadow Dragon said in chat is actually what I was really thinking. Here, Greg, have a chance. You said it before. Greg, I you said it before. One of those best moments in live stream you made so far. <laughs> the, you're really going at, like, at these zombies. Oh, Ooh. there's a third chainsaw! Yeah. I mean, isn't it, doesn't it always respawn if you come back oh, yeah, into the area? Yeah. yeah. After the boss is oh, defeated. They, they changed that or something? Because in the 360 version, you can only have one. No, here, every time you come here, respawn. So you can you can stack to the as with chainsaw. I, I kind of now want to just stack nothing but like infinite chainsaw. So now you can just have like probably 22,000 kills. Oh my god, they are running away from the bookstore! What the hell are you guys doing? <laughs> I think it's because that they were what? having an argument. No! Yeah. Man, what the fuck are you doing all the way there? <laughs> what the hell, guys? Are you crazy? The... You talk to me. Oh my god. Talk to me. Thank you. Yeah, I'm different. What the fuck are you guys doing what? here? Stay there. Why? What's the purpose of just running away? What the? That never happened before! Yeah, that. Oh. Yeah. Hey, what's going on with their AI? I don't know, but one guy was just running around his friend. Who are you? I'm photo, photo taker journalist. I, you go safe place to get the cheese slice. I'm Frank. At, least they, get, at least they get the whole thing down when you just are you go? Japanese. Looks like this man has got food in What do you think? What? Uh, do you think I will think I'm choice for butt shots in? My friend, she will hear you. Yeah. Some kind of joiners will come with the story, but clearly for something wrong with this. This Japanese sucks. You won't understand. Shh. He'll hear you. Japanese sucks. He won't understand. <laughs> I guess for some reason, just Frank gets like so fluid with Japanese after reading that book. Well, only reading it, but that's all it. your fault. All the places you go. <laughs> this dumb thing. Roger. Why you ain't one of the who? You Tanaka. Shinji. Oh, where's he going? Oh, he's going to the bathroom. Yeah. I was thinking. They're going to the bathroom because of the, the pointer. He'll be the weapon. He'll be the. I think he'll be the great, a greatest. They already have the weapons. One of them have a chainsaw, and the other have a katana. They're just going to where the marker says to go. Yeah. Thankfully, they will be safe. That was pretty funny in preparation. And they're like, this vacation sucks. Oh my god, Shinji, dude. Dude, don't tell me you hit me with your, my own chainsaw. <laughs> really? He hit me with the chainsaw. So he is using Adam's chainsaw. How much damage did he do? Nothing. Oh, I like how he's not. Freaking Frank West just does that old spin on the floor. Like, oh, oh, Shinji, oh. stop looking and just move to the fucking safe house. Or the bathroom, like, I mean. What? That sounds horrible. Move to the oh, bathroom. Yeah. Greg is alive in the bathroom. I, I do so kind of right now. Oh, I do recommend though on the next part since you're gonna be close to the safe house, try oh, to yeah. at least get Greg healed up. So it's like him in the bathroom, look at like healing come back for them and just run for it. Yeah, actually, that would be a good. Because half his health is gone. Oh yeah. yeah. I'm gonna go for. That's the problem. Actually, I'm gonna go back. When I go and stack with Joseph, I'm gonna heal myself. I'm gonna heal them, and I'm gonna. Oh, another, uh, 
I don't say in Spanish too. Another uh, queen. I almost say Killer it. queen. Okay. Killer queen. Okay. okay, so I'm gonna stack Fucking with Jojo. orange juices. I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna give them orange juices. And everything will be happy. Oh yeah, you wanna know the funny thing I actually did at one time during this uh like my first playthrough? Yeah. I actually barricaded that entire yeah. area off right there with all those chairs. I literally had so much time I wanted to waste on it, I just started like just putting chairs everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> so useful. Did you ask it me? was it was fun because I think there's nothing like no zombie could get in. They couldn't even hit the barricade. Oh, so wow. I'm just standing there looking at them. What happened? No, oh, that actually is useful. Don't tell me they are stuck in the... Yeah, they are stuck. Okay. Maybe Rick. they just have to follow Ow. you. Yeah. Ow! Rick! Uh, Rick, please, take this. Just call them. Oh, no, you know what I, I actually really hated the most about uh, <laughs> the AI in this game? Yeah? Everything. The fact that when you yeah. give them a healing item, one simple brush will make them drop the healing item. Oh, yes! So they're just like, oh, drop the healing yeah, and everything goes well. <laughs> Alright, I think you should be good for the rush there, because they've got all those chainsaws. Yeah. Oh yeah. Make the run for it! I mean, unless they act like a complete dumbass and just like stand in the middle of the horse swinging at everything, and you have to like call them 17 times in order to make them stop. Well, thankfully I have a queen, so if that happens, oh, I can that's true. That's okay, why good. I'm stacking a lot of queens, so I can try to have one of them to prevent that kind of situation. But still, it's the AI. They are ready to help a Yusuf. Welcome to the frame of the writing, where I'm a oh, psycho Yusuf. teddy bear. Yusuf! Yusuf Hello. Paw. Okay. Yeah, he's I'm not sure how many people are coming in since we've got Shadow Dragon coming in. He came from my own server. Over there. That's, uh, there's seven right now, I think. Uh, not counting, uh... Oh my god, Shinji! I knew it! I knew that was going to happen! What happened? What happened? Shinji it. died. No, Shinji's not dead. Shinji's still alive, but he's stuck. Uh, oh my god, he's idiots! <laughs> oh my god, he's idiots! I just love the way you just said that. Oh, so now I see. Me. He's stuck Sing because he's Sing Shinji, or else he'll die. Oh my god! <laughs> Shinji, get in the Eva! Gosh, I'm Shinji, what the hell are you doing? Just. Oh, the over freaking here. bugs Stop. are like ramming into him. Shinji, get in the Eva! Shinji Mikami, just come! <laughs> Shinji Mikami! <laughs> really no, a, Shinji really Mikami! How will we get Bayonetta 3 if you die? Exactly! <laughs> we need you, you alive! The you is the best to be honest, right that would actually be a funny crossover if that actually happened. <laughs> Like what if there was just a certain mechanic in the game? Like, just like took a chainsaw and gave him a pocket knife. <laughs> what is the best dead lesbian though? Shinji Mikami just as a survivor. <laughs> Him living or dying will be sent to Capcom and then they will decide how badly we want Bayonetta 3 by that Rick, stack. Thank you, have a baseball bat. Thank you, Rick. Have a baseball bat? Uh, so. I need my katana back. Well, I don't probably need it, I have three chainsaws. You don't need the katana anymore, you got yeah. the chainsaws. Oh, the chainsaws, I think, are, your, are you gonna be your best mm, weapons for the bad. rest of the game from now on. <laughs> are you oh, Rick, she, you up. stop doing love and come here. What? <laughs> you will see. A soccer ball? That's what I saw. Come on, let's play soccer while in a zombie apocalypse. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, there we go. That's like the only, the only soccer ball been played in, 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 in zombie apocalypse is the... The Walking Dead, Telltale Games. Oh, it happened in episode two. Oh, I still remember that. Yeah. Wait, did, wait, did, I actually thought of that. Like, okay, let's go to North Plaza now. Shadow of the, of the North Plaza. Why does that sound pretty cool for some reason? Even though. Interesting. Okay, definitely I have chainsaws, so I can also deal with claims in my way to the north. 
that probably will be the plan. I'm gonna go there, I'm gonna deal with Cletus, and that will be all. But I'm gonna go for the Shadow Zone class. I think you remember what it's actually too, because I don't remember correctly. Oh my god, are you kidding me? They're back! Yeah! They're always gonna be back! For some reason, they're like the most unkillable thing in the game. You kill them, they'll come back. The nope. convicts, they escaped prison, that's why. They escaped prison. Wait, wait, should you tell me that if you kill them, you just send them straight back to prison? No. It's like Mexico all over it's the It's just that you oh, kill the three, oh. the three new ones appear. Yeah. They're the same guys, yeah. they the same face. The, the, the same appear. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Are you telling me we're dealing with clones? Are you telling me we're dealing with prisoner clones? Probably. Exactly. Prison clones. <laughs> Attack of the clones. I know this oh. is not a Smash Bros. Four. This is real Attack of the clones. <laughs> Marth, Lucina, Marth, Lucina, Marth, Lucina. Okay, before going for the Shadow of Mount Blast. You know what? I don't know why, but for some reason you saying their names over and over again reminds me of like this one game I remember playing where you never just look at the characters, they just say their names out. So you have, uh, I don't know if you've ever played this, but have you ever played uh, Castlevania Fortune of Ruin? Whatever, they just scream out, Jonathan Charlotte, Jonathan Charlotte, Jonathan Charlotte, Jonathan Charlotte. Oh my god, yeah. I, I love how fast you can actually get them to say it, and they're like, Jonathan, 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 they're just like back and forth like super fast. Jonathan, 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 Jonathan. Oh god, the Japanese one. I, I love the Japanese voices. <laughs> Wait, have, you ever, have you actually ever seen the cast of that? You can hear how fast someone has to go with that. I watched someone um, play through Dawn of Sorrow corrupt the game so badly that they deleted inputs. <laughs> oh, here's the, the boss. That bear mask just does not fit. <laughs> Speaking of Castlevania, like I kind of want to play Donosaur again. Nobody. I do not like Donosaur that much. Hey, psych psychopath boss fight. Of course, I, I do want to play Donosaur. Okay. Oh yeah, Donosaur is so good. Yes. I love the theme of the corridor. Oh, sorry. Oh, it's <laughs> Remember the corridor theme? Oh, yes. And he's doing that. Uh, the, 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 the oh Jesus. Okay. You know what, Cletus, I'm gonna go out for a moment. Gosh darn it, let me get out! <laughs> I remember that the, the one of the methods they said to try to prevent damage is to stand behind one of these. Yeah, but the problem is, the hitboxes are The hitboxes are, are terrible! Yeah. Yes. Okay, this is what I'm gonna do. Crowd. I'm gonna come here. I'm gonna let him throw me away. Wait for it. This is what I'm gonna do. You're gonna get wasted. Yeah, I'm gonna get wasted, but that's the plan. He's going to three, I'm gonna go in. And I'm gonna get oh, thrown away arm. because apparently I did it wrong. Yeah. Oh my god! Okay, Why did you just stay there? What? Okay, I did not damage to him, <laughs> so I'm gonna get out. Oh, he actually throw you out. <laughs> I did no damage to him. What the hell was that game? Oh, you dead? Oh, no. no, I'm still alive, but what the hell? I hit him with a chainsaw and I did not damage to him! Oh, you're about to tire Rexo! At least he shot you out of the store! Yeah! Rexo, what I originally did was I opened both those doors and I just shoot him from the outside. Because I just screw him and his goddamn knockback. Can you take the guns out from inside? Yes. Like, the inside the outside the display? No, oh, you can take guns in that display. Yeah, that's a good idea. Die, Cletus. I don't care. I know I say I don't want to do this with Psychopath, but this guy is really annoying. Die. Yeah, he's the one Psychopath yeah, just that's like not even worth a legit fight. I feel yeah, like he poster. might be, because if you kill him, then this will trigger Damn, survivors to spawn <laughs> in there. What, what are you, crazy? So, so while he's dead, the survivor. There you go. He's dead. Actually, save them as well. Like I say, I just gonna. I don't want to use the mega poster, but it's only the last resource. No, nah, he's just bullshit. Just murder him. Yeah, that's what I did. No, no, no. 
that took him out. Actually, now you now you that you reminded me. Hey, uh, Rexo, do yeah. you ever think of planning to play uh like any games in the future? You got anything planned? Eh, he got either playing the zombie. Actually, now that you mentioned anything planned, there is a game that I kind of want to play for the future. Uh, after the Dead Rising, so I just have to check if I have enough time for that moment. But there is this uh. game from Suda51 called Killer is Dead. Oh yeah, I remember that was from the, uh, the Resident Evil, the Resident Evil uh, 5 uh, stream. You said you were going to play that? Yeah, I really want to play that game because it's actually really obscure and also really fun. There is actually uh, a game that I've wanted to recommend for you since I remember that you did play that one uh, NES game. That uh, two D uh, what, what was it? What was it? It was that one with the uh, you played like, like demon that had to like hunt down other demons and get powers, get stronger and oh, all that. Oh, uh, Demon Quest. Yes, that one. Uh, I I was wondering, do you play a lot of two uh, D side scrollers? Because there's one that I actually found that you probably might like. I typically like to play a lot of different games, so you can suggest me a movie, whatever you want. There's one called, um, it's actually kind of new, it just came out this year, and it's a fan game. It's, a uh, Castlevania Ricard Chronicles 2. Ricard, oh my god, that's the name I haven't heard in a while. Oh, yeah, you literally, you literally play as the ancestor of, uh, uh basically Eric Lacard. It's basically AKA Rand. Yeah, you basically play, uh, Efrain Lacard, which is his, like, uh, ancestor from, like, the 1800s, I think. Something basically, actually... another one. It's actually very cool. They did the first game, which is basically no. kind of just you know standard whip, re uh, like you know the whole whip and everything reclone type of deal. This one is taking the whole um, Symphony of the Night style, where it's basically like imagine Castlevania two, like you know that uh, Simon's oh, Quest, cool. but mix it Sorry. in, but mix it in with uh, Symphony of the Night. Oh, like yeah. Metroidvania style. Yes! It's even got the weapons, armor, it's even got like the multiple different endings. It's very nice. The soundtrack is pretty cool. Actually, yeah, leave it in the... I, I think it's the suggestion channel, or it's not leave it in the general. I yeah, like there's suggestions. Uh, let me see. Uh, I'll, I'll type it down. Yeah, so, so I really want to take a look. Crazy guy trying to kill me. He's talking about the uh, dude from the yeah, from Plato, market. Because, like, you can see he's also sleeping. Supposedly, David got hurt by Plato. So that's why he hides there. Hmm. So he mentioned one boss that you have to find out very soon. So, yeah, exactly. No, that's actually the, the, that boss because if you come to David. He tells you about someone crazy that shoot him in the gun store. And that's when you go to the gun store and find Fled. Because he doesn't appear in the scoop, you know about him from David. Oh, actually, I got the timeline wrong for, uh... Oh, that was him. Efrain. Efrain, Efrain Lacard's actually from, uh, the 1700, 1781. I think this is actually before, uh... Bloodlines. Well, Bloodline was actually during World War II. So it was back in the 1950s. Whereas this one is 1781, so this is like the uh, grandfather of Eric Picard. Actually, yeah, you're true, Cello. Frank is really kind hard with psychopaths. I mean, they're trying to kill him, they see how they kill other people, and when they defeat him, he's like, I'm not going to kill you, he's like, I'm just gonna look at you and hear what you have to say. Maybe I can save you. And then, then, and then we look over at, uh... Oh no, I can't even remember his name. I... Oh <laughs> man. Um, Chuck Green. He always has to pull up some bullshit one-liner. Oh. I know, I love Chuck Green! He always just <laughs> you know, like, up stupid yeah, one-liners. Fire. And he's literally fire. The first <laughs> I love that! <laughs> okay, uh... Alright, there you go. Me or Frank was rubbing David's back. Check that out. It's actually a very good fan game. In fact, so good that a lot of people actually kind of want to force it into the Castlevania storyline. I mean, they do get retcon the one female vampire whip user. 
Oh my god, yeah, that lady from the Sophia. Show. Isn't that non canon actually? It's retcon to not be canon. But yeah, I remember that like about some day writing to her. Yeah, she's also like what the hell. Okay, so. so is it me or does it look like Frank is rubbing David's back while he's carrying him? Yeah, I like oh shh, calm down. Everything will be fine. Come on! I'm just a cute teddy bear, I just want to hug you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. I do that that so bad. <laughs> Isn't it weird? He just, he just he just took an elevator elevator while the zombies are inside, and then suddenly they di disappear when you hmm. travel. So that's what Doctor Barnaby said. <laughs> yes, that happens. The old coot's not dumb. David Bailey, do you have a son a named Justin? Oh my God! One of these cutscenes. Uh. Ashur, do it, you, <sighs> can you see Game Grumps? I'm gonna make a stupid reference to one of the commentaries of Danny made in one of these cards. So, if we want to get our heads cutting out, Rex, so. we're gonna have to secure a way oh, out of here it. ourselves. Cuts in time. Alright, we've what? gotta deal with the situation we've been handed. The boneheads back at HQ might be working on something, too. There's a helicopter coming. Damn it. Three days from now. At noon, it's my ride. <laughs> Is your ride reliable? Absolutely. Nude. That's how I plan on getting out of here. <laughs> All right then. I'll see to it that the DHS picks up the charter fee. Can we take Dr. Barnaby as well? Sure. Three days for as now. As you tell me what's at going noon, on. it's my ride. Okay. Okay. I'll tell you what you want to know. And it's already been Later. one single day. In the we have more pressing business right now. Dead rising. If yeah. we have to wait here, for three days, damn we'll long need supplies, time to do a uh, water, blankets and the like. We'll get Dr. Barnaby here tomorrow morning. I want you to keep an eye on the monitors. <sighs> that psychopath. Yo, Frank! <laughs> give me a hand here. Hey. What... What gives? Considering the helicopter and all, we have to work together. <laughs> but that doesn't mean we can tell you everything. And everything we do tell you can't necessarily be printed. Yeah, so? That mask. So, work together. I just want you to appreciate the situation. Well, Don't you just love that mask? Zombies. Yeah, I think I appreciate the situation just fine. That Winnie the Pooh in a zombie apocalypse. <laughs> zombies. I you know, the best the crossover. Yeah. Seems so uh, Yeah, I think that looks like watermelon soda. I can dream. You all right there? Even with a mask. Yeah, I got it. Zombies. Oh, I can actually put it inside. That hamburger looks horrible! <laughs> Wait for that part of the cutscene and you will see. You should rest a while. Wait, which hamburger? I want to see it. Wait for that part of the cutscene. Hamburger! Glamburger. Oh, <laughs> oh my god, that hamburger looks so fake. Oh <laughs> yeah, it's definitely okay. fake as I'm looking at it. <laughs> Wait, wouldn't the hamburger be like I don't know, cold already since it's been already been hours that when a zombie apocalypse happened and when when a zombie attack and wait, I don't know how long would a hamburger be cold already and taste? Most bad likely already? it would be room temperature cold. Yeah. yeah. How would you have a good time eating this hamburger that tasted very cold and badly? If it's if it's been a couple of days well, of zombies. Cold, Attack. like Shadow Dragon say, cold, that if it's not moldy. Alright then. Remember eating all the moldy oh, wow. pieces the of food in Dead Rising 2? Oh god, yeah. Look at that. You're like, I'm just gonna put my chimney, so nope. hopefully I don't put the button and, well, yeah. and switch the back. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot. And okay. Jessica is sleeping now. Yep. I see Greg, he's gonna be standing right there as well. Okay, I have time to spare and to kill, so... 
I could really want to go for some food items. I kind of want to keep the mannequin because what's actually really useful against Adam. I agree. Okay, let me check my watch. Photo challenge and the mansion monitor. Yeah, I have them time to spare. Wow, that's surprising. In this game, you almost have no time to spare like this. So that's actually surprising. Emits other moderator. <laughs> okay, I can have time to chase a. Uh, uh, what is the name? A uh, B and check my list of survivors. September 20th. 8 p.m. Oh my god, why the queen spawn so high? That's bullshit. Run the queen. Hey, Ooh, Cello! John. The hey there. Ah, uh, Cello! Hello, Hello, Cello! Hey guys. Yeah, oh. just... Hello. <laughs> yeah, I just decided to join the talk for the stream, so... Yay! Yeah. We got a kitty! Woo! <laughs> Pet the kitty! I'll be so. just analyzing the survivors and what stuff happened because I'm going to be Otis to the stream. Apparently the next survivors are until 7 a.m. So I still have time to kill. I'm going to look for other things to wear here. Or progress uh, the story. What time is the next story segment at? The next story segment... Uh, let me check actually. Imagine the monitor. Actually, I can look at the cases. Uh, case file. Uh, 6 a.m. So one hour later, there will be the, the scoop chance called the lovers, and that will be another survivor. The lovers? Yeah. Is the lady with his husband that is hurt that he doesn't want to live without him? Yes, he doesn't want to leave without something. him. I feel like there's gonna be survivors from this, from this pink bunny, or what you call it, holding on. And they will be like, "Can somebody help me and kill these zombies?" It's what it felt like. It's one of those cliche moments when when someone just has to be a pussy and 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 stay on top of their tree. Yeah. Oh, now that I think about that, there's actually some they, they may appear in that area, but yet the but that one will be later in, its, in the future. Yeah, that will be later. The only way to, put, to get them down by throwing any any object to hit them and they will fall off. I, I suggest a toy item will be good for them to get hit and fell off. By the way, is this still day one? Yeah, it's still day one. We're yeah, so this is night one, I think. We're almost done. We're almost going into day two. Oh, okay. One hour and one single day, actually. It's actually a good time. I was not expecting that. I'm gonna board Miss Frank now. So, do you already get the pictures that, uh, what's this guy's name? Ben? Kent? Kent. Ask you. <laughs> yeah, I got the pictures. So, thankfully, that won't be a problem. Oh, okay, I couldn't come earlier because I was busy, you know, uh, tending to pet cats and hiding yeah, and you just were, making uh, coffee. Well, at least you came in time to watch the fight of Adam the Clown that you wanted to see. Yeah. Yeah, it was weird. I was washing dishes and so it just came to me like, oh my god, what if he's fighting Adam right now? And I just ran here and I saw you fighting Adam. <laughs> also, I, I have to admit that thank you for letting oh me know. Oh god, that frying pan though. I was really surprised to see that the mannequin was so damaged. I never played the game myself. Ooh. Like, all I know is just from watching a lot of people play it, but I've seen them constantly, yeah, like, right hitting too. people with the mannequin torso. Mannequin torso is okay. Yeah, we can see that. Because every time I hit him, up. he like the 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 chat. I really like how you Rex that you cook up the frying pan and, and kill off some of these zombies. It gives you some good amount of HP, but not much <laughs> of for fighting and get against other zombies. Yeah, it's it's just like a funny detail. So you literally press the hot frying pan on your face. Yeah, I really oh, like I how you done done that. I remember they brought up, they brought that back in the Resident Evil, killing people with a frying pan. Yeah. Yep. Also, I want you to look at this. Uh, Toon Makers. These stories in if you can see in Dead Rising, they actually recycle completely the stores. They only change the texture. But it's oh, the yeah, same it's the same exact store, layout. Yes. 
So, like, back there, there would be a safe room in the dressing too. Yeah, That's in true. this wall is the door for the safe room. But here, uh, there sorry. is nothing. Mantena. Oh, oh my god. Yeah, it's like completely. I do not know that. Yeah, all yeah, the stores same store. are actually recycled. <laughs> Entertainment Isle is also recycled. All the stores are recycled. I think that except for the Jill Sandwich store. Right? But did they no. actually recycle the, the fourth game? Like, like it does take place the same place in Waterland. So, so did they recycle the first game to the, the fourth game? My favorite psychopath from the game. For Dead Rising 1, of course it's Adam the Clown, Adam. probably my favorite psychopath. <laughs> from Dead Rising such a 2, crazy boy. it's actually hard because all the psychopaths are really cool. Probably, uh... I don't know. All of the cycles uh, are really cool in Dead Rising too. Antoine, uh, the chef. Actually, yeah, because of the music, probably. Yeah, they have. They 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 really they really made uh, what's the word? Like they did a really great choice. Like I uh, sell to other soundtracks. Many yeah. of the psychopath sounds. Um, for Dead Rising Three, I don't remember the name of this guy, but it's this cowboy that have a giant flame trower that looks like a thing. Oh, the one that has the flaming. <laughs> yeah. Like... The funny thing oh, is, yes, yeah. <laughs> the, the funny thing is that guy in Spanish, well obviously you don't understand nothing, but it's the same voice of Goku from Dragon Ball Z in Spanish. Yeah that guy. Thank you so Yeah Dylan. Yes, Dylan. It's the same voice from Goku in I'm in Latin American language. Oh my god, are you serious? Yes, it's I Goku. Never knew that. <laughs> terrible. Imagine the monitor. Okay, imagine the monitor. Where's that supposed to be at again? Yeah, I, I need to go down to the... Uh, what's it that? To oh, the safe room? Imagine the monitor. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go to the safe room because it's when we're going to see... Uh, I think... I tend to remember. Oh, actually... Barnaby! Yeah. Oh. yeah. You're running With, out of time uh, for him, it's the moderator. Is it because they're going to call me supposedly when they are... The mission is active, but I don't gonna take the elevator, I'm gonna take the alternate route. It's a little longer, but it's also tough. Why are like the cooks in these games like the worst to fight? <laughs> I don't know. I'm thinking of that the second one who can get all their uh their health, health back. back. Yeah, that's Antoine. It takes like five seconds and boom his health is just fully back. Yeah, oh, you mean at Antoine? Yeah. Oh, but he's, uh, he's pretty easy. Just shoot him once, he'll stop eating. Yeah, nice. but you have to get lucky because his freaking frying pan knocks you to the floor for a god long Oh, yeah. Time. He has a homing frying pan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's so hard to deal with. I like the fact that that whole fight, he grabs a knife. Next thing you know, frying pan. It's like, what happened? Did that knife just magically turn into a frying pan during the cutscene? <laughs> Oh wow. That cutscene is funny. Who the hell would want to eat that? <laughs> Apparently it says, according to Frank, it's safe to go to sleep with a chainsaw in your hand. I mean, so, sure. Hey, bro, so are you gonna up? keep that? Are you gonna keep that servo mask the whole game? No, I changed it. It's because I was trying to look for the goblin, but I don't remember in what store. So I'm gonna stay here and, and spin in circles around Grant. Oh, the home is circle. Oh, he's just following you, he said. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I know, but if you talk with survivors on Steam, they're gonna follow you with his game. So, well, do you have a Lanka yeah, mask they, in this game? They or do is that. that. Yeah, look at their face. Yeah, Thank you for saving uh, us and support someone like that. Yeah. Yeah, they hold me in frame, but yeah, they just. <laughs> they're heads. Man. Okay, I need to kill time before the immersion in the monitor thing. So, I'm gonna pick this football, I'm gonna open the doors of the thing, and I'm gonna kick the ball to the phone. I mean, you only have oh God, 13 kills away from a thousand. I'll, I'll be right back. Alright. Okay. But yeah, it's surprising that so far we're doing good. We saved all the survivors for the first day. Except for Jeff the first time around. Alright, oh, that's why we had to restart. Yeah. Because he just died for whatever oh, reason wow. up here on the safe roof. Yeah, he died from loneliness. He was, I want, I'm lonely. 
He couldn't find his wife for some reason, who was just on the other, on the side, other side of the, of the fucking roof. <laughs> A wall got between him and his wife. <laughs> that he could easily walk around. That actually made me think in Leshauna and Gordon yeah. in the Rising 2. Oh, oh nice clothing. God. I need to find my Gordon. I don't know where he is. He's at the store right in front of there. Oh yeah, the survivors. Survivors are idiots, remember that. Yeah. They really are. Okay, so at, least, at least they're like a little less idiotic in Dead Rising 2 than the first one. First yeah, one is just like, oh. Yeah, they improved the AI, thankfully. Because here is a pain. The first time you just tried to save survivors, you went... Actually, there is... I have to share that video. Uh, there was one guy that I showed one time to Cello, that he was trying to save uh, survivors. He literally rage quit at the end of the video. Oh, I don't remember that. Yeah. Well, I remember rage quitting RPG... What her name is? The, the purple lady one? Lesbian one? She rage quit playing Red Dead Red as well when she start, start playing. Oh, oh wow. uh, RPG Blade? means. I think that's the name of that. Yeah, movie. he did rage quit on this game as well. I had I know a lot of people that had attempt to play this game not full level like I'm doing right now, uh, like originally from the beginning, and they do a lot of rage. It's because the survivors are really stupid. The zombies can grab you really easily, and also the psychopath, like, the first psychopath fight you have is with Carlito and his machine gun, and he can literally drown, drain two or three squares of your health. And then there's Adam with his two chainsaws. <laughs> yeah, and the single balloon of the chainsaws, if you have four squares, is an instant kill, because there are only four squares of damage, that balloon. So yeah, all the psychopaths are really, really overpowered. That's probably why a lot of people do race me on this game. Yeah, because it's the first one, it's kind of primitive, so it's pretty it's pretty tough. Yeah. So it's actually interesting how in the second they're rising the zombies they have they're slower, they have a harder time grabbing you, the survivors are smarter, and the first psychopaths they are in a tough. It's like they learn or something. Yes. Yeah, thank you. And we have got all the feedback from this game and they also made their text larger. Because when this game came out, like the only way to read the text was if you had like a what are those HD TVs? Oh my god! Wide screens. Oh, I forgot. Are you supposed to wait for image of the moderator expired? No, it's because I can't. I reached to the security, but nothing happens because the problem is I need to uh, wait for. Brad to call me so I can so the mission can be active. That also happens in Dead Rising 2. There are some cases that you are not there, and when it's red, you got a call from Stacy and it's like, hey, come here to the to here, I find something. But if you come early, nothing happens. So that's why it says that starts at 6 a.m. So I just need to wait uh, 15 minutes, 50 in-game minutes for that. But hey, at least we are doing surprising I already saved, uh, I got some funny fails that I have to admit that a lot of people actually love. Uh, let's see. Oh my god. The only thing I don't gonna like about this next uh, case is because there is another fight that a lot of people love, that is Carlito and the fucking sniper. No! Because if you guys remember that, in the second case you have to help Brad fight Carlito again. But this time, this guy has a sniper. Oh yeah, and that sniper takes like three health in one shot. Yeah, he have really good aim with a sniper. Uh, the sniper trio. Yeah. Oh god, those guys later on. But this is Carlito with that like anti-material rifle. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that one! Yeah. Yeah, he that does have an anti a pretty huge freaking rifle. Yeah, he's that really good just... aiming. I'm actually quite surprised Frank can actually survive a single shot from that thing. Yeah, that thing would jump down almost anything. Exactly. Yeah. Just gonna come that we can't actually ever there we get go, that's the mission. 
You know what kind of sucks is the fact that we can't ever get any of those weapons that Carlito uses. Yeah, that's annoying. Yeah. Headplan Shadow. Wait, for real? Sounds like. Yeah, now I got a call, so now I can go Take back. Take care, Shadow. Don't cry too much at the game. So the mission had to start. Fuck it up. Yeah, right? Have fun, Shadow Dragon, playing Dragon Pro. I, that, that game, I know it. I need, that that need Dragon it. Rumpa, it's Don Gun Rumpa. <laughs> huh. Oh my god, I, I always really wrong. What is wrong with me? Oh yeah, I have all device. That's yeah, my... You have to head to the security room now. Yeah, I have to go to the security room. Yeah, uh, yeah, Why are you always right reading really like part. Dragon Rumpa? Why am I that stupid? It's not Dragon Rumpa. I don't know why <laughs> I read it always the time like that. You know, I want to try to draw the mother, what's it called? It's also got their, their own anime as well, like Persona 4. Persona 4 got their own anime, and Dragon, what's it called, got its own anime as well. Ah, oh, you're leaving, okay. Yeah, it's got two animes. It's got one taking place this, that tells the events of the first game, and the other one that takes place after the second. At least it's better than the Phoenix Rider. Oh, yeah, I have yeah, not seen the Phoenix Red anime. I have well. seen it. There's some scenes that are fun, but uh, it's like for people who have played the game, it's like uh, I wish it could be better. That can't be good. Okay. I just can't wait for What's Apollo Justice anyway? to come back on the 3DS. Oh, yeah, Someone that's called like really the professor and told him to come to the school. Then I can have all six games on my 3DS. So was this the caller? <sighs> this guy here? That's the. That's it. They've got something to do with the zombies, don't they? Okay, yeah. Okay. So... We have to go and help Brad. <sighs> Risky the Professor. We have not too much time. But thankfully he's right on the other side of this planet. But there will be the horrible fight right there. I don't wanna use the Mega Buster unless it's really necessary again. Time to help the professor from Carlito and his amazing rifle skills. What? Looks like the shoulder leading to the entrance plaza is open. Time to save the man, old man. Yep. We gotta save the professor. That. Barnaby Jones. Yep. You know the professor also appeared in in the fourth game, but only by mentioning him. He's only by name. Because, you know, he's dead! I know he's dead, but he has to leave mentioning type of... He yeah, has, he has cute, to leave been mentioned. It's like a cool thing, like little easter eggs that try to make the other... The Dragon Game. Plaza right the Paradise Plaza now. Well, at least it's better that easter egg than the stupid Jill Sandwich. Jill Sandwich. Yeah, that <laughs> open now. By the way, Jill Sandwich does, store doesn't appear in Dead Rising 2, does it? Yeah. Jill Sanchez appeared in Dead Rising 2 and it's actually, but it's not really that big of a score, I think. Well, is there a Jill Sandwich in Dead Rising yeah, 2? Yeah, Jill Sanchez is in the, is in Dead Rising 2. Yeah. But what I think, oh, in the fourth quarter, that's true, I remember. I don't know if you had noticed, but I told two people here, uh, there is the Jill Sandwich and there is Chris Find Food. Both of the <laughs> yeah. characters are actually related to food. I didn't know. No, we just need Wesker. <laughs> oh, no, <laughs> no. Wesker's name is actually. Yeah, Wesker's name is actually. It has to be a sort of sales name. Wait, I, 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 I have a feeling though. Well, what names can you guys come up with for Wesker's food joint? Something about Something eggs. Wesker's egg farm. Yeah. Wesker's egg farm. <laughs> <laughs> because good. that's on John. Yeah. I was actually, for some reason, I was thinking of uh, Wesker's. Hold on, I'm trying to think now. Wesker's Diner? Watch out, Mama. Nah. That nah, doesn't have as good <laughs> as That's too normal. Actually, I know. Wesker's Excellent Food Restaurant. <laughs> excellent. <laughs> what? Uh, and the big no, Wesker's the Superior Eggs. <laughs> Wesker's <laughs> Superior <laughs> Eggs. Really? And the picture of the <laughs> restaurant movie. And then we hear and clap. Oh, so you're my T virus. 
Oh, if we don't do oh god. Oh man, sloppy. I remember seeing a picture of sexy Wesker, and it says, I'll what? show you my T-Virus. Okay, I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Oh shit! That's a good aiming, Carlito. I love the music of these fights with Carlito. Oh goodness. yeah, those... those the, that theme right there for him is actually pretty cool. Of course, you want to know what the theme I kind of want to say, but I can't because it's going to be spoiler as hell. Yep. Well, you know, whatever. It's still going to happen anyways because every game has yeah. something like this. The final boss. Oh. You remember that, was... that theme? Yes. Oh. I don't know why. I just love the way that it sounds. <sighs> like when it goes more into okay. the song, it just sounds more like really creepy-ish. But Careful. then it gets back into the battle. Oh, that got hurts. Nope, it would be really painful to fight against Carlos. By the way, you want to know the funny thing that I originally did? Oh shit! I let, Br I let Brad fight Carlito. Oh. Okay. <laughs> oh shit! I was distracting him, and Brad like comes up behind him, just like shh. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> what are you doing, Rexo? Wait for me. This is Brad. What the? Come on! Oh my thing? god! Oh wait, he can't shoot you because oh. Uh, Oh. Oh, oh my god! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Why weren't you dodge rolling? I forgot to roll! <laughs> okay. Oh my god, Rexo. Uh, it's your fault. Yeah, I'm gonna. Oh god, no. No, don't kill me, don't kill me. I, I... Oh my god, why don't roll, Frank? Roll! There we go. Oh my god, you shoot the thing, thank you. Oh, you asshole! Thank you, Brad. Okay. Oh, you tackle him. Oh my god, you're dead, finally. I hate you. And all thanks to Brad. He's the one who helped me there. Brad! What the heck? And no thanks to Brad. <laughs> I love that he just throws the sniper rifle over the edge. Well, I mean, it does get into a pretty cool, like, miniature shootout where they're just, like, two He's shots exchanged. But alive. Yeah. Yeah. Which, what I'm quite surprised is Damn. how in God's name did all of them all right? kind of yeah. miss at that range. I'm not <laughs> Frank didn't even hit him. Brad hits his arm. Carlito hits his leg. But at that range, you could hit someone in the tour so easily. And I'm just like, what, what kind of pistol accuracy is this? How the hell did he hit Brad in the leg when it looked like he got shot? In the shoulder. That's what I'm wondering. Yeah. Brad, oh my god. Because this, like, it's just the accuracy. Plus, they shot two. Where'd that other bullet go? Did it just like fade from existence when it came out? <laughs> Don't worry. Right, just totally shot. <laughs> <laughs> you that you now everybody say. now now everybody realizes that now is the fact that where'd that other bullet go? Yeah. It's just oh gone. my god. So it's gonna make it sense. It only happened cutscene that. Because this is never fired. Like shot. Shot. A person before. But Brad yep. can feel the pain after getting <laughs> shot during the cutscene. Remember, remember, Asura. Oh wow, you don't have to do it to me. There's nothing we can do. Now. He's going to be black blue. forever. Yeah. Oh <laughs> my god! That actually is something that's bad. Fucking game grumps. One of game grumps. Fucking game grumps. In one of game grumps episodes, uh, that yes, happened. Uh, she's actually touching Brad's head to feel his temperature. And Danny is like, there's nothing we can do. He's going to be black forever. Like, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness. That commentary was like, what the fuck were you thinking? Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So medicine run. I need to find a stun gun because this is a fight in the uh stun gun. I. Oh. Oh okay. yeah, I know which psychopath is coming off. The uh, best way I think you can find a stun gun is breaking open the boxes. Like, you know those red <sighs> cardboard boxes? That's the best way I've managed Wait, to Wait, did I just saw... Oh, wasn't that Isabel? Did she live in the supermarket? Yeah. Okay, there is only cabbage. But I really want oh, a stun gun. that trigger another boss fight coming through? Yeah, that's going to trigger another boss fight. I really want a stun gun. Mm. I want to test that theory that 
someone told me. Leave that word. Wait, stun the psycho store in with the stun gun? Yeah, apparently uh, if you time it right you can kill him in five to six seconds with the stun gun. Yeah, Shadow Dragon's got it right. This is my store! <laughs> oh yeah, now I remember this. This is my store! That book is amazing. I don't know how I'm my store! <laughs> I remember. Hey, by any chance, have you guys actually realized that when he actually does that last scream, you just see like the little like screen like flare going on? On like the edges of the screen? It's just uh, yeah. like... I'm actually quite surprised he doesn't yell at you as like a ranged attack that just knocks you on your feet. <laughs> Actually, like, he is the true Dova King! He is the Dragonborn! Is this also Frank West Hyper Combos as well? <laughs> Imagine we had a job at that. Yeah, that's right. He exactly <laughs> came from. From, from the Rising one, actually, the, the, yeah, the. The mall card he uses in one of the superpowers in My Bros. Capcom 3 and Infinite is actually from here. Uh. Actually, yeah. I kind of want to check on You can see now. a zombie is, is actually sitting on wait, the... Wait, 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 wait. Oh, Isn't the stun I... gun the lesbian cop's weapon? Also. Oh, oh yeah, there is the stun true. gun. Okay, there is. There we go. Oh, you got one? Yeah, I got one. Oh, gun. okay. Cool. Alright, never mind then. Okay, so we need to go to... Uh, South Plaza. This is my store! Well, I don't need to worry oh about killing Oh god, guys. I remembered about the freaking shower head when you stab on a zombie. Oh, it's starting <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Literally shower of blood. <laughs> yeah, that's actually true. Until they die. Yep. Yeah. Uh... Actually, what would be faster if you went through the park or you went through that... Uh, no, actually, going through the park would be probably faster. What would be faster if he ate quick step? Yeah, actually, it does. Or better, yeah, why not get a skateboard? Yeah, skateboard! Oh my god, yeah, why did you don't got a skateboard? I'm not real. I really said Yeah, why have you not oh. been doing this? Yeah, it's on the second floor. Okay, in the first floor. It's in the basic. Yeah, you're basically in the same place, it's just on the second floor. You know, like right across where you get all your uh, food from? Yeah. That's where you, uh, you get it. Oh, it's, okay. They're, just, they're like racks of skateboards. You could just like technically just get a whole bunch of them, and there you go. Be careful of their, div their durability. They they only take like what three or four hits on normal before they just break. So if you oh, hit like right. three or four zombies, they'll just break almost instantly. Yeah, it's not, it's not really that durability. Okay. Does he have one of the books that'll make it last like <laughs> two more hits? Probably. I'm actually quite surprised how there ain't no maintenance book for it, so you can survive like up to like 300 hits. Power <laughs> <laughs> right through all the zombies, just like at full skating speed. You don't care about nothing. Okay, let's give it a try. Oh, uh, here, here we go. This is that, my that's, soul. Oh, that's yeah. done, though. I like the fact that you don't have a good job. You just say fuck the doors. Don't give a shit about doors. Fuck doors. <laughs> Oh wait, I realized you got the Surfbot mask back on. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that, command is... that commando clothing though just works. It just makes me think he's my Kagar wearing the Surfbot mask. Let's <laughs> Let's go. Oh my god, this cutscene. I, ju I don't gonna skip it because it's amazing. It's no, amazing. Don't, don't skip this cutscene. No, 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 no. But I can imagine now your character just putting on the Mega Man boots with that costume right there and the hat. <laughs> <laughs> Just for maximum looks, get him the Mega Man shoes. So every time he takes a step, oh, go ahead and make that. Doo, 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 doo. <laughs> I'm probably gonna put them when I'm back at the. I like how he's got motion blur for that cutscene right there. Wait, what the hell? Is that motion blur? <laughs> I do love the reflective surface of the Servbot mask. Some yeah, of the that, it's very that's what clean. made it good. That's what made the Servbot so mask good. So neat. <laughs> this shopping store is pretty amazing. You like clean and no damage. My store. Huh? Not on my watch. Someone's been hurt. I need medicine. <laughs> hurt. That's just what this bitch said when she came to vandalize I'm just my thinking store. now of just like Commando Servbot. I don't take That'd be such a great character to any game. <laughs> I won't allow it. 
Of course, I'm still thinking, put a Serpot mask on any character you can oh, think of. Yeah. There you go, you can make probably on the kind Mario, Luigi, and Bowser. Oh god, I can just imagine the Serpot masks for all of them. <laughs> Of course, I'm also thinking now of, like, Princess Peach with a surf bot mask. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> oh, here comes the yell. Look at that freaking... Like, he's a dragon boy! He's, he's yelling, Fusro, die at you! Okay, so what was the point? You had to fight him again? You had to get him into a corner? Yeah, I think to get him come to me. Like, are you shooting at you? <laughs> I like how he's got aimbot. He just knows where you are. <laughs> there we go! Oh, there we go! It's rude! Wait, what happened? Wait for it! Wait, it's a super Oh, guys. Oh, guys. Oh, 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 wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Let's Holy see. shit! Oh, that's not doing a boss fight. Oh Holy my shit. god! <laughs> you just melted him. <laughs> we know. Oh, this, this boss got turned in, got turned into a joke real fast. <laughs> wow, that's <laughs> all of it. Oh my oh, stone! Oh, oh god! Oh yeah. My shit! My shit! <laughs> Have a nice day! <laughs> that was a good boss, I like! Have a nice day! Well, did you know this stun gun makes marvels with this guy? Clean up! Register <laughs> Customers! Clean up and I'll sex! <laughs> Have a nice day! <laughs> I'm gonna be the best one. Register sex! <laughs> uh, <laughs> I love this. Oh, <laughs> so I'm bad. Store when I'm gone. <laughs> While he's dead, now zombies can be rolled around the store. Yeah. But now, there you go. That's the power of the Back stun gun in this boss wedding. fight. One, two, wow, three, I didn't expect that to end so quickly. <laughs> Me neither. <laughs> that, that, it just melted his house. I saw you at the entrance yesterday. Actually, you know what I'm kind of like surprised about? You needed medicine. Trying to have the conversation with her when he together. realizes that that uh, Brad is technically you dying right now from a me. sickness and he just stops to have a conversation. You're the ones who caused this nightmare. You Isabella. <laughs> yeah. And no. all this. Carlita, that would be a fun name. <laughs> Carlita. <laughs> Carlita. <laughs> but yeah, I, I'm also surprised because I just hear about the stunt gun, but I never tested it out, so... Santa Cabeza! <laughs> but yeah, I, I was like, oh my god, I can't believe it. It actually worked. And it only wasted uh, like 27% of the stunt gun. I got Mamacita now. So does that work with every psychopath or only this psychopath? I, I hear it with this psychopath, but I'm gonna try with another one probably later because that was surprisingly good and fast. That was actually surprisingly entertaining. Just zap, 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 zap. You can't do nothing, yeah. guys. Oh, no, no, <laughs> I'm Carlita. <laughs> what else you can do after this? Uh, let's see, lovers. Oh, the machete. Okay, I'm gonna, like I'm gonna go. Oh no! Oh, I'm gonna we have go. to escort guys. So I'm gonna go back to the safe house to reset a little the time, and I'm gonna go back and fight the psychopath with the machete. So, but that's Cliff psychopath coming up. Oh, there's uh, actually three survivors on this part oh, yeah. after the boss fight. Yeah. Isn't that also where you can grab that? Uh... That, that third healing book, so like you just restore all your health with like one jug of uh, orange. Exactly. Okay, so let me check the survivalist book. I okay, There's actually three, three survival might happen around. Oh my, you got less time for a medicine run. Yeah, I'm gonna go try for the medicine run, and after that, I'm gonna go for the lovers. Rex, uh, restock on quick steps. Yeah, that's also a uh -oh. really good idea. I'm gonna... Oh boy. You have such little time. Yeah, the do you time. Have like, do you have like five missions to do with little time? Well, yep. That, that's yeah, the way the Dead Rising is supposed to be. 
Dead Rising 1 was unforgiving with the time. Yeah. But if you beat it, you, you feel like you've done really good, actually. That's why in this game, that challenge of saving all the survivors is kind of hard, because there are some survivors that they give you a really, really small amount of time. Strict. And mixed with them, there is also survivors that doesn't appear on the actually, radar to uh, find them. Actually, I was gonna ask Rexo, did you do you actually have the Mega Man boots? Because I don't know if you want to be running around Commando with those fucking journalist shoes. I actually have the Mega Man boots. The only thing I think I don't have is the suit only, but I have the boots. Actually, how did how was the suit unlocked again? I think you have doing to various it. achievements. Yeah, uh, uh, the suit you have to survive, if I remember correctly, seven days in infinite mode. No, that was the, uh, the Arthur's um, un underwear. <laughs> Oh, it's also one of the hardest mode, and one mode that that Frank would take damage slowly, and you need to stack up food for him, or else you'll die. There's one challenge; it's very hard to do it. Okay, if you look die, at this. Then, then you have to start all the way over. I'm already done. Yep. And the next case is at 11 a.m., just five hours later than this. That's really, really not too much time. Exactly. I think it's a Mega Man one. Yeah. That's fine. Oh yeah, okay. boy, I can't wait to see how you look now. Thanks for bringing back the medicine. Oh, nice. Well, I took care of taste too. Let's see, let's see. <laughs> Mega Man! <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna go for. I say it through. Probably I can go right now. Let me check. Professor's okay. pass. I'm gonna go for the lovers first because that's the one that is almost done. Well, uh, check out the time list, like like goal list or mission list. Yeah, I already checked, and the lovers is down. It's a little more have less time than the one from the Cherry guy. So I'm gonna yeah, so do can... the lovers one. Yeah. Actually, yeah. let me go real quick to the bathroom and. So Alright, make, the... make sure you do it quickly before it times right now for Professor. Yeah, to lovers more. and Professor Past will be probably both of them very, very close to each other. And because I'm so gonna... glad the time. Oh, sorry. Go ahead. No, no, then no, I'm only gonna think that because probably I'm gonna be really close on time after the Professor. I'm gonna have to go to the to Ken to show the, the photo, and after that, I'm gonna go to the Shady guy. I don't even think you put the thing on the mission. You know, the point to arrow. Yeah, but thankfully I know it's actually pretty good. Good. Yeah, I was just gonna say Let's that. See, I'm if I, glad if I that. Like these two. Yeah. Let's see. Time is more forgiving in Dead Rising. Okay, they're pretty much <laughs> in the clothing store, isn't it? Yeah. It's the sports yeah. store they're in, right? Yeah, here. The only problem, and also something I hate about this game, you can't skip the dialogue. You have to see. Oh, there is a threat. What happened to, to one of them? Ross, is that his name? Oh yes, Ross. Yeah. Rexo, whatever you do, do not give Ross a gun. Trust me. No. I see the information about Ross. So if you give Ross the the wanted boyfriend, <laughs> and if he asks one for the gun, he will definitely shoot himself. You can actually take picture of him for extra PP, but... and that can make Tonya unsavable. Yes, yeah, so if you want to save oh, both of them, don't give him a gun. No, I'm yes. gonna give them. I'm gonna give them a gun. Yes, just don't give him the gun because it seems he's having that mental breakdown. Oh no! <laughs> yep, he's having a mental breakdown right now. You... No way. What the hell is going on with these two? Rose, um, I think he has been beaten by a zombie and he's... Actually, I think it's a uh, survivor attack him, I think. Ah, uh, yeah, survivor attack him and he's hurt and he think he's going to die, so... <laughs> well, unless if you actually get him out of there. No, I don't want to get him. Okay, for Tonya, she's really a great character to, to, to run along what? with you, so give him a great weapon for her. For Rose. I'm gonna just... give her another chainsaw. Awesome. 
But remember, just don't give Ross a weapon. Don't worry. Um, I, mean, a, a I don't have a weapon. gun. I don't even have a gun. Good. Accidentally gives him the Mega Buster. <laughs> <laughs> you Damn. Oh my god, that would be hilarious. Yep. Oh no. <laughs> One of my favorite things is sweet how all said that. Okay, well, wow. Tanya is actually a sweetheart character. Um, okay. I don't know how long it takes you to convince people to come after you There's when time is running out. <laughs> I'm sure it was a man. He looked really scared. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we got another horrible mission that is almost done, guys. called the Cowards. Come on! Come on, Tony, I just moved. You have a chainsaw, so you have no reason to get stuck. Oh, you're giving him a peek back, right? And I'll call. Somebody in a, in a home garden shop is an outfit. Is, is it look. Good at them. I'm pretty sure it is a man. He looked really scared, but he must be dealing some heavy stuff right now. Okay, I'm analyzing this character. He's another side. Oh. You need to hit him a little so he can talk with you. So I see as I'm analyzing Gordon, this character that you're supposed to save him as well. General Ava Carnegie, he is super calm, but he'll never fight. Just let the zombie beat him up if you're going to to save for this guy. Number one, for most expendable server, don't bother him. Unless you're going to take a rust in the bathroom shortcut. Oh, the Gordon's gonna be really tough to, to save him. There's Tanya. Wow. She did amazing. I knew she'd be great. She'll do it all for her husband or boyfriend or at least. Stop getting stuff and just run to the fucking bathroom. I want you in the bathroom. There's a gun right there, so I'm so glad Roz didn't pick it up. Yeah, no. If he no. did. Okay, uh, well, Roz, come here. Okay, Tony, you follow me because I can't carry two people at once. Come on! But you have a fucking mini chain. If you can't protect me with a mini chain, though. So Just spam the call button. <laughs> Follow me. Okay, she's doing so far. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take Ross all the way here. Damn it, Ross! I owe you one. Over there! I'm gonna protect Ross because game growth will not be complete without me. Yes, even he's black now. Oh my god, Tonya, are you kidding me? Tonya, don't die on us. You're like the best character around, Survivor. Yeah, run. Run, lady. Michaela! Okay, there she is. Okay, she's out there. Yeah, she looks like she's stuck. Now. Hey Rex, so I bet what you can wait to get, to get that book from what's the game? The cult leader. Pamela Tompkins? Who she was or where she was? What? what? Someone died? Someone what died! Pamela Tompkins what? is dead. Who the hell is who, that? Who the hell is Pamela Tompkins? Who? Hold on, let me search this up. Yeah, I'm trying to search as well. We saved before then. Let's things. See, this is uh. Oh. Actually, yeah. It, if we save, we can reload. She's being attacked by uh. You you just passed her, by the way. 
Hey, I did? She was in that last room because she's being attacked by a horde of zombies right outside the toy store. Oh, oh that's the one. Oh, okay. Oh, damn it, I forgot. Well, we're gonna have to kill she's this right. guy that's with a, the store that's again. What, yeah, that's the thing with the game. They tend to make you, like, random. Yeah, uh, okay, you're in Wonderland Plaza. Yeah, I'm gonna have to deal with uh, this guy again, I think. Are you, are you gonna do... Okay. Oh, that's a lot. Yeah, I'm gonna deal with this guy. Well, he's not a lot. You have seen that with a stun gun. I can kill him in that. No, I mean, the whole thing that you had to do to get the lovers, and then the medicine, and then now running back. Yeah, but I think uh, probably if they are uh, survivors that spawn in the time, before going back to the safe house, I can probably stop by there and grab them. So I can probably grab prob Pamela. They probably are there, but probably they might have spawned in during the time you were saving uh, the lovers. Those two, you know, Ross and... Man. Actually, yeah, let me check real quick. Uh, what? what actually also really sucks about fighting, uh, or not fighting, but saving her is the fact she's surrounded by so many zombies, any swing you could accidentally hurt, hit her. So you do need a. Uh, this is why you get okay, a queen. Yeah. Okay, Always have a queen. 9 a.m. Ah, I need to check the second It's called a zombie, Jay. Oh, I almost got him. Well, I don't get, I don't got him at the first attempt, but I did a ton of damage. So, chase though. But yeah, I, apparently you can kill this guy with one single there. But there we go. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> yeah. He did the spin. Yeah. Oh, God. He just hit you with that shotgun. Yeah, that's... Too bad you can't uh, keep that. Shopping uh, cart of his. Yeah, it's a bit Oh, yeah, you yeah, can't. He has to repeat because he missed the survivor and then ended up dying. He oh, accidentally so... passed right by them. Oh, so he's, is he attempting to get all the survivors? I'm trying yeah. my best to get them. Uh, yeah. That's gonna, that's gonna be rough. <laughs> yeah, yeah it's gonna be like a great achievement. I'm gonna try to save right now before going back to the plaza. But, but Chela, this isn't the most roughest thing to get an achievement. The most roughest thing to get achievement is this one mode where you have to survive while you're losing health. So oh, you're forced infinite to mode. Yeah, the infinite mode. food items. I heard about the infinite mode. It's like uh, survive as long as you can. Yeah. Yeah. Then limited food, food, limited yes. survivors to kill for food and all that. Yes, and if you died, then you have to start the story all over again. From the first day. Yep. And it actually takes like, how many hours in real life? Like seven hours? Every day oh. is an hour, exactly. Yeah, and you have to fight, the seven, you have to survive seven days. So, so, wait, wait, they're asking you to play straight for seven hours? Seven hours. In one sitting, yes. So oh, you can that's get an rough. achievement and also oh, very. unlock. But you want to know what was worse before? I actually, I don't know if you were here to hear it, but there was this glitch on the Xbox 360 version where if you went into a specific area at a specific time near the last day, or the last ish day, your game will just crash. <laughs> and that happened yeah, to me. Yeah, it's terrible. No, it, happened, it, it happened to me actually. And I lost uh, the. Uh, you actually get the Mega Man Sword, something. which is actually the most Brother. powerful thing in game. It can like one shot like most Three of the other first bosses you actually fight. Can you at least like pause the game in infinite mode? If, like if you have to go you to pee pause or something? Yeah, you can pause it. You can pause it, but oh, okay. if but you, you exit the save. game, uh, you lost it exactly. You can't save in that mode. Yep. So I'm guessing the best time to play Infinite Mode is during that weekend or something. Exactly. <laughs> during the weekend and start at the beginning of the day. Oh, okay. Yes. And then uh, when you're at night time, it's, that's when it should end. Wait a minute. Also, the that mode doesn't give you like 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 pause or, or a save. It doesn't give you a save, but it allows you to pause the game. So you like the pause menu actually still works. So you can't so you can't save again and come back. Nope. Nope. The whole purpose oh. of that is to survive in one long sitting with, exactly. no, oh rest, my God. with no real rest. You know and that kind of I hated that type of achievement and it's just too much for me. <laughs> wow. And to, get, and to get the seven days achievement, you have to survive in that mode for 18 real life hours. 18? Jesus, I don't remember. Yes, that. that's how long it was. If wow. I'm gonna do this challenge, I supposed to be like having like. Wait, how many days is it? 
for the whole for just one in-game week, it's 18 hours. Damn. Oh yes, playing 18 hours straight. <laughs> Yeah, you had to leave the game on for 18 hours straight, in infinite mode, for 7 days. So that's for the achievement, to unlock the Mega Man thingy? I think the 5 day one is the Mega Man one. Yeah, yeah that that's for the Mega Man one, but if you wanted all the achievements, 7 days, 18 hours. <laughs> seven days. Funny, funny thing though is that as soon as you get that uh, few hours done, you can actually instantly go and grab the sword from the safe room. Exactly. You but, you, but it's not saved forever in your game. You have to actually save the save file because, uh, yeah, it may spawn there, but it's not actually saved in the profile yet. So if you do that, you're gonna look, if you just quit the game thinking, oh, I have the item, you're gonna lose it. Oh, <laughs> oh boy. You know, it kind of reminds me of uh, Outlaws 2, the highest difficulty in the same mode. It has something like that, where you have to beat the game in one city. Oh yeah. I remember that there's actually one thing like that where you have to play this one game through the entire way, from start to end, in one sitting with less than three or so deaths. Or five. Which game? What, what game? game? Oh, yeah. You remember that game, that side scroller in the in the black and white where you can literally see a kid get their head decapitated by a bear trap? Yep. No, that what? game. Oh. It's, it's limbo, it's some yeah, no, I I this game oh, limbo. Then that kid, that same kid, can get impaled by a spider's leg. Yep. Through the head, or through the rest That's of their body. Nasty. Or you know, the no saw blades. Oh. Yeah, just the saw blades. Well, the saw blades no were the worst way. one because if you get hit in a specific angle, you can literally see like everything inside of them go flying out, and it's all oh, like God. shadow. It's really gruesome. It's really gruesome and it makes you feel kind of sad for the kid. Alright, alright, Rexa, Rexa, uh, don't give Ross a gun. Don't worry, I don't have a gun to make adventure. Good. Rexa, 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 give Ross a gun. No! no. I, can give him, I can give him the stun gun. Yes, let him in like you. That is technically a gun, so yeah, you could technically give him that. Yeah. Okay, but this is going to go out of I see. It's terrible, people that's what it here, is. So. Well, I don't get it. What happens if he gives Ross a gun? He'll, He'll kill, kill himself. himself. And Tonya doesn't want to come to you, so you lost two survivors. Basically, all the whole mission is to end. lose two there. survivors. Exactly. Well, well, I didn't get it. He, uh, he goes insane or what? He's no, insane. He's... If you give him a gun, he kills himself. Oh, yes. I get Antonia, it. Antonia, because he doesn't want to let him go, he don't follow you. And she just kind of stays there and basically and they, die. Exactly. they both die. Well, oh, because he knows he's gonna turn into a zombie or something, so, or he thinks he's gonna. He then he shoots himself, right? Yeah, he shoots himself. Oh, I get it. Antonia, yep. because he's, he's wise, she doesn't accept that and she doesn't follow you after that. <laughs> also, I think he'll be also a zombified as well when he kills himself. Because there's a video that you can actually find Thanks. every survivor, if you fail, they will become a zombie. Isn't that like, only if they basically die near you when you're escorting them? No, if you didn't do the, the work and they die off screen, when you look, when you go back where they were, up, where they spawn, then you see oh, them yeah. as a zombie. Yeah, I still remember that the first one from earlier. It's too bad Cello missed it, but uh, you guys want to tell them what happened with the first two survivors? Oh, yeah, like right at the safe room. Even the even the guy from from Ad Adam's attack, which he can definitely die if. If Adam disappeared and and you would see him walking as a zombie, and then no shortcut for so you. He got out the ride but died. Yeah, that's what sucks. If you don't save that guy, you don't get the shortcut, and it'll just be the worst thing you'll have to deal with. And you have to feel, and you're gonna feel guilty when you see the per the person that you're trying to save as a zombie. Oh yes, just the same double guy. There's also a survivor that teaches you a shortcut if you yeah. have. To save. Yeah, least, but that one you need to give her a food item, a drink. Yeah, at least that's easier. At least this wasn't to, to, to give you a guilt trip. Making you feel guilty. Oh, wait a minute, I forgot the one character that, that you need to save. Or who? Pamela, whatever yeah, her name yeah, was. You know, the character died out of nowhere, right? 
Yep. What was her name again? Pamela something? Tam yeah, Pamela, Pamela Thompson. Tom Pamela Thompson. Thompson. They are actually at the disc and the toy store right there. They're apparently they're outside Charles playing part of the plaza, right? Oh, got it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come back here. I'm gonna tell Over them there. to stay there. And I'm gonna go quickly to save them. Because I know exactly where they are. Yeah. You are where are they? Shop, you can't. They're at the toy store in the first plaza that you start. Yeah. Not like the actual one where you have to escape that horror, but like the one where you actually start the game. Yeah, they are oh, okay. actually right in front, right there. Yeah, there he is. That's my middle. I was wondering why the hell there's like so many zombies all of a sudden. Yeah. Yeah, you have to basically run all the way up there to where she's in the water, throw it in as fast as you can, get her, and then just start making a run for it. There we go. Yeah, there she is. There's also another person inside the toy store, too, so... Yeah, I know. But thankfully, she's not close to me. Yep, she's just kind of there. It seems been well, around she's the losing her fast. Oh. Rexo. Yes. <laughs> oh, wow. Now she got inspiration for you. Oh, there she is! Yeah, there she is. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna... Rexo, I have a tip for the next time you just face a horde of zombies around a survivor. Yeah. Oh, just no, kick no. them. Just jump kick them. Alright then. There's no way out the way. We need to stick together. We broke that now. There's one inside. Oh, God, I shall press that. It's a dangerous game. I know. Shut up. Uh, okay, so I need to go here. Wait, so you're supposed to spawn inside a toy store? No, she's, uh, the... Pamela one is supposed to spawn. Would you shush? I appreciate it. Oh! <laughs> Who's calling you? Off because Dad turned it off. Who's calling you? So we got four oh people God. in. I don't yeah. know what happens when you have to live with kids. Here. <laughs> That's so cool. Oh my God, it's more stuff He's going like, on. I'm trying to analyze these people. <laughs> so yeah, there we go. Heather, see it's okay, but she will fight if you. Oh my God, weapon. Pamela doesn't went there. Are you kidding me? Overwhelmed easily. Oh my god. Idiot. Right, so you gotta take care of Heather because you get overwhelmed easily. For Pamela, Pamela, female version of Gordon? Our Nanaka she may slightly worse because her AI is similar to Tanya. But similar she would never leave Heather's side unless Heather dies since Heather can be carried like Ross could. That's a problem when she is a good survivor without Heather. There is a shame. Okay, now I'm having a problem. See? Go get OJ! Yeah, I'm gonna need to go on jail, but first I need to tell people to come to a safe place, like, Over here. There. Oh my gosh, again? Wait, did you, did you reset? No, I, don't, I don't reset, but... Man, I swear to... the survivors, they have dead wishes. <laughs> Yeah, that's the problem. The survivors are kind of stupid. Like, they just want to die. Just put him inside this jewelry store. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, give Heather a weapon, Rexo. <sighs> oh, yeah. She did. I mean, he did. I did. Uh, probably Shut the fuck up, Otis! That's like the fifth time Otis. he's calling you! To the oh, other God. lady, I oh. can't give Otis her out. Otis is a lonely weapon. man. <laughs> right, so give Pummel some food because he's about to die. That's what I'm going to do. Yeah, I, I, that's, what I, I, that's what I told him to do. Go run. get some OJ. Yeah. Run, Rexo, run! Or milk. I realize how many people you're actually saving now. Oh, wow. Oh, it just keeps calling. You, get, yeah. you know, it's a lonely man. That's a big And that's, wow, uh, that's why I hate the that there's an achievement. For... I like the fact you just ended his call. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck him! That's why I hate that there is an achievement for answer absolutely all of the calls without uh, without missing one without or missing one or, or interrupting it. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait! There is an achievement for not missing one of his calls. Exactly. Yep. If yes. you miss one of them or by accidentally change of items and hang him up. I like how you, you just gave the everybody their chainsaws. I think Pamela needs to help more. It's like the programmers knew he was so annoying that they made an achievement to every his conversation. Yeah. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> yeah, everyone's chopped off. There's someone inside a home garden. Oh, so that. Okay, we already knew that. Okay. And who needs some food? Come on. All of them are yeah, they already got it. So they're, awesome. they're good. They're all chopped okay. off. Just call yeah. everyone over and get in the door. Also pick Heather? up Ross. Yeah. I feel bad for Ross because he, he can only limp. 
Okay. You get so tired and almost instantly. You guys stay there because I want to clean first the area coming to you guys. Oh, please do it, Rexo. Run, Rexo! I like that one of the air headed AI is just running right into the corner. Like, this is where I'm supposed to go, right? That kind of yeah. sounds like it would be there. Yeah. So, he's a bad dude. If you got Kama dies, Heather. Okay, there we go. You can save Heather, it's just the fact that Rex was trying to get as many of the survivors. Exactly. Yeah, or Heather will keep staying with with Palma as always, but if Palma dies, then Heather will be like, okay, I don't care Palma, Heather now. Yeah. So it's will be okay while going with you, uh, but I'm sorry I'll leave please. the call. Probably lost the internet or something. <laughs> but yeah, don't worry. Oh, I thought you were talking about, um... I thought you were talking about this. <laughs> Oops, sorry. I misclicked. Hey, Welcome okay, back. <laughs> I went into another call. Oh. That sounds like what happened to me one time. That actually sounds like what happened to me one time on this other server. It's this, um, I, Rexo and Cello know what server it is, but I've accidentally, uh... Did you just get punched by Frost? Yeah, I get punched by Frost. <laughs> Oi! Heather just shoved Ross! Holy. <laughs> Heather never liked Ross! Ross did punch Ross actually punch Rexo? Yeah, yes. he actually did. Yes. Yes. He was trying to punch a zombie. They're both punching a zombie at the same time, Ross just like scores him okay, right across so, the head. There we go. Okay, there's all the four. Alright, sweet. I awesome. Yeah, there's all the four. Alright, sweet. Awesome. Yeah, as soon as they're up on the ledge, they're eligible to get in. Okay, so get it up, people and ladies. Oh boy, what? Oh no, they're, 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 they're glitching out. Okay. I hate when they do that, they just like run into each other and they're just like, how are we supposed to do this? Okay, I'm gonna save right now because I don't want to lose all the problems. Yeah, go save. Okay. Come on, ladies, get up here. Okay, it's already nine. Okay, there we go. But I'm gonna do, let me check the. Uh, I'm gonna do the. Uh, we have to do this challenge. way here, right? Okay. Four people. That's amazing, right? So great job. Yeah. Okay. Now this is where the problem begins. I have the. It ain't no Frank the pimp, though. Yeah. What's the maximum number of survivors you can get? Oh, at hey. Eight survivors at Eight once. Eight survivors at once. Oh, I just. Uh, There's an achievement for really getting it. it. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna oh, see so. if Kent already spawns, so I can do his mission. I don't want to do the cab war because it's really far away and I will be able to do it. Actually, you can check the map. Let's see, Gordon. Yeah, photo challenge. Uh, Let's see, Gordon, he was spawned out of the way where the go- the He's in a fresca blaster. Yeah, I probably- Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna see if I can- Oh, Gordon is gonna be really tough to, to save him because he's actually a coward and he can't even fight. Yeah, that would be the problem. And he's actually the most expendable survival. Okay, so Survivor. this is what I'm gonna do because I'm already going to do the spook that is a professor class. I'm gonna do that one, I'm probably going to save the game and I'm gonna continue this. And I don't know if you guys want to wait for the next weekend or if you guys don't mind if I continue tomorrow. What's your choice? Uh, hmm. I mean, you're gonna stream on Tuesday anyway, so why not continue tomorrow? Alright, then, then I'm gonna, oh, maybe, then yeah. I'm gonna go to the school, I'm gonna save the game. Oh key, god, gonna... I just realized some of my posted about um, Super Mario 64 online. I need to get that. Yes! <laughs> so yeah, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go to the oh. school and I'm gonna continue tomorrow. Right, uh, I posted the uh, Lacard Chronicles 2 into suggestions. Perfect, so I can Including check. Including the uh, download link to the page, so there you go. Oh, the download link too, perfect. Yeah. I like how that elevator was so empty. <laughs> exactly. He's yeah, we right. know, lady. He going to be he should black be fine for now. You don't have to tell me. <laughs> Let's Jeez. see, another survivor that you also you can save black, him, yeah. but I think it'll be later after you save Gordon. Oh. A fat man loves his yeah. food and he never explored problem. Oh, are you talking about that one guy that if you don't give him food, he won't follow you? Yeah. I offered to help her, but she took off. He was a pain to deal with when he was in an area that has no food. Yeah, or I'm gonna 
bring probably anyway, some from. She was saying something about Santa Cabeza. Santa Cabeza? I think I. Oh! I see now. Is it just me or is Frank's wrist look like they're Your detachable? It <laughs> looks detachable. Santa Cabeza. Like a toys. I should have known. Because that damn watch makes it look like his wrist isn't My even there. Santa Cabeza was over and so the hands can just move in whatever direction. You plan to dispense justice now? Calm uh, down, I think the problem Dr. is Barnaby. after this case, there We're will be the only following cult. orders. We have to protect, protect. you. Protect! Uh, More like him. Oh yeah, there's actually another mission. Professor, Did anyone here record? You. you just kind of got cut off by the... All of it. This one cut him off. Talk to us. Yeah, he got cut off. Oh, sorry. I was saying oh. that uh, the only thing I don't like is I think at the middle of case four, I'm gonna have to think wisely what I'm going to do and then how to gonna manage my time and my survivors because at the half of it is where the cult is going to appear. I think. During okay, case four. another. Another Actually, isn't that the part where you have to get like the cultist and then like someone else there too? Yeah, the, you so get the cultist. Actually, let, let me go. Just gonna go out and just take a quick look. Oh wait a minute, Rexo, Rexo. Another thing, you, you have to take a picture of Jessica's, Jesse's cleavage for Kent cha challenge. He's already got a picture, actually. Yeah, I already got two pictures. One of Jessica's at least one, one point, one thousand. Actually, I can show you. And actually, uh. That reminds me, right before you actually go to meet Ken, yeah. like when his thing comes up, can you be able to- Oh wait, no wait, that's the next one, not Ken, where you have to give him the picture. Yeah, on the next one where he asks for like, some kind of like rematch or something on that. Yes. He, uh, right before you actually go up to where he is with the guy that he's trying to infect, if you go to the music store there, there's gonna be another survivor at that time. Oh, okay, thanks for letting me know. Okay, there is no- yep. Oh, good. Okay, so yeah, the plan tomorrow will be actually that. I'm gonna try to do the hatchet man and the coward. Preferably the hatchet man first and then the coward and the restaurant man. Probably the photo challenge and yeah. But that will be for tomorrow because sorry, getting a little late. But so far. Wait, tomorrow's we... Monday. Yeah, tomorrow is Monday, but because I'm gonna stream uh, Thursday. Wait, tomorrow's and... Monday? Yep. Yeah. Tomorrow. Today's Black. Sunday. What in the world? My freaking remembering of time was garbage today. So yeah, tomorrow. <laughs> continue the driving. I literally, I legitly thought it was like freaking Wednesday. No, it's Wednesday. <laughs> what? Oh, oh yeah, yours is way off. <laughs> yeah. No, but yeah. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try to do my best to see how much I can do progress tomorrow, because Thursday uh, is the DLC for Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite, and I want to show the three downloadable characters. Thursday or Tuesday? Uh, 17 of this month, so I think in two days. So yeah, that's Tuesday. Oh yeah, that's Tuesday. What the? Oh my god, I'm wrong too with days. <laughs> so yeah, tomorrow is... I'm gonna continue this, and the next day I'm gonna do Marvel's Capcom Infinite, and hopefully I can do some progress. If I can do really good progress, probably Saturday I can be able with overtime. Yeah, then Sunday you can start off the record. Yeah, with my friend Ashur here. Yeah, what a sad thing, I won't be able to watch a stream on Monday because I'll be at college. Alright. Well, definitely it will be recorded, and I'm also gonna have another call so people can join and have fun. Wait, you're gonna play off the record? Yeah, I'm gonna play off the record the next weekend with my friend Azur here. He will be my oh, friend. nice. You're gonna have fun with that one. That's an amazing game. We already had a, mom a funny moment, and I'm gonna share it. Yes, we did! You wanna go get that photo? Yeah, I have the photo right now, so I'm gonna show it before. Oh, wait a minute, did I miss this? I gotta see this. Wait, what are you talking about? Uh, it's because time ago, Azur and me were testing the game to see how the online connection works for one of us. Oh boy. And yeah. a funny moment that I caught literally on a photo that was unintentional. <laughs> everything in that moment was everything just going wrong for me. Exactly. and I was like we can say per, per, frame perfect picture the right moment when everything went wrong 
What, are you gonna post it here in general tab or what? Yeah, I'm gonna show it the next weekend when we do our, <laughs> of the record. Oh, you're uh, gonna do okay. it then? Oh, you're, you're cock teasing everyone well. right now. <laughs> or, well, uh, probably I'm gonna. Actually, yeah, let me close the game real quick. Uh, let me look for for it, actually. I think it's in our chat, right? Oh, oh, it's me. oh, it's in my second screen. Okay, let me check. Uh, let me see if I can find it. Uh, if not, then don't worry. Okay. Yeah, because I wanted to hear you guys your reactions right here online, but I need to see if I can find it right now because I have it in another uh, carpet or folder. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? <coughs> if not, then I'm just gonna have to sadly end the call, but I will share the picture there. <laughs> All right. Yeah, because I'm just trying to find it. Uh, actually, I'm gonna look on our chat. Uh, uh, let's look. Probably it's in our chat. Okay. Uh, I think I'm gonna browse our chat real quick. Okay, there is. Uh, you found it. Yeah, I find the picture. So All let right, me. I gotta see this. Let's see. Uh, you found it. Yeah, Go I found in, it. Go uh, in media share or. Yeah, I'm gonna put it in media share. So there you go, guys. Let's see. Frame what... perfect moment. What the hell? <laughs> <wrong? laughs> uh, <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, actually, let, let me sh nice. share that to people who are who is probably wondering what the hell I'm talking about because there must be people right there. Actually, there. no, I forgot. Nice. Uh, can't you actually do the co-op of that one mod? Uh, what mod? Well, not mod. Uh, uh, the DLC with um Frank and Chuck Green actually working together. Oh, oh off the record. I... That's off the record multiplayer. Yeah. Oh well, my god, it's suddenly. Yeah, yeah, it's off the record. <laughs> oh, I Let actually thought off the record was the uh, Frank it. West version. Uh, apparently, yeah, for yeah. some reason, I can't capture uh, the screen mode. So huh. gonna, uh, yeah, what? off the record. Yeah, definitely. But but notice this there's a, a, a one drink just in the air. What? Yeah, there is just one drink. That's right. right. Hey, Rex, do you still have a picture of the Chuck playing the, the guitar for the zombies? I think I, uh, I, I think it's in our oh, Dropbox just, actually. Uh, guys, someone. I think that was supposed to be repel, and it's just in the air. I tried to drink it because I was oh, throwing yeah. up. <laughs> I was throwing up because I was drunk. I tried to drink to heal myself. I got on the mechanical bowl by accident. Rexo was getting ready to take a picture of me on it. I wasn't ready okay. for the bowl, and then I got flung off, and he took the picture. Yeah, that's a picture. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Everything was just going wrong for me at that moment. <laughs> exactly. So yeah, <laughs> you can expect a lot of craziness happening during our stream of the rising two of the record, probably. <laughs> oh man! Just oh. that, just that mixed drink in the air. I just love it. <laughs> hey, all oh, the dead rising games. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Rex, uh, I found the picture. Do you mind if I post it here just to show well, it? Uh, yeah, please post it. That's there you go. Cool. Ooh, interesting. <laughs> <laughs> That's, That's a bit nice. of a shock doing this. Oh, I know this guitar. It's actually cra crafted by, I think, one of those audio stuff you use it for. Yeah, yeah an amplifier and a guitar. Yes. So it became a, this. It'll be like a Scott cool. Pilgrim style. <laughs> yeah. It was yeah. a cool picture. It looked like he was playing and the zombies were cheering for him or something. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I really hope you guys uh, had fun Actually, tonight. Actually, hey, Rexo. Yes? Have you ever played Bioshock? No, never played it. Oh. But I will try it in the future, probably. Also, guys, someone drew a picture of my character, Henry. Oh, please. Oh. Please. But yeah, for you guys in Twitch, thank you for I don't know for why. Being. I really hope you guys had fun <laughs> tonight in this crazy live stream of oh, Dead yes. Rising 1. <laughs> Like you guys here, I'm gonna continue tomorrow, the same hour. So yeah, thanks for coming. Hope you had fun. Yeah. And it was fun. I can be able it was to fun to watch. Really good. So yeah, here with me were my friend Azur, uh, Cello, 
Dusk, Dovahik, and Kai, so... I'm actually, uh... I probably should change my username, so you'd probably actually recognize me a little bit more. Oh, yeah, I, I know you oh. from here. Hold on, let me see. Uh, uh Ah, here we go. Okay. Do you feel like a good thing you're friendly to round? Oh, yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Land, that's Land Rada! Yeah, they were right. here, so... I recall all of you guys had fun, and for everyone in the call here, thanks for for coming, because... The soul of this stream were you guys, not my gameplay. We're actually you guys for being here with me. Oh, watching you play the game and fail was fun too. <laughs> yeah, but and that couldn't be possible to make fun if you guys were not here laughing and sharing. Salad Dragon has sent a link to my server over the game that you guys are talking about. Dead G Game Grumps Dead Rising Mega Compilation. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> after the, yeah. the gameplay see that you, you finished. We'll see you tomorrow for the next. For All right. See you, everybody. All right. Yeah. All right. See ya. See ya. <laughs>